Hello, everyone, and welcome back to the Iowan Adventures, a world created and ruled by the Fae. I'm Jessica. I also go by I Sneeze Stars online and places like TikTok and Instagram and all that other fun stuff. Um, and I will be your shenanigan sovereign tonight. Uh, so really quickly, I'll run you through our uh, shows that we have. So Monday nights, obviously, Iowan Adventures. Tuesday nights, we have the State of a of the Union, a shadow run campaign um, run by uh, Coddlesworth at 7.30 p.m. EST. Thursday nights, we have the Lost Continent at 9 p.m. EST uh, by Mr. Markham. Friday nights, we have the Legends of Kralis at 10.30 p.m. EST, a TTRPG created and GM'd by Telerius Game Master. And alternating Sundays, uh, I think except for this Sunday, we have Rumors of Magic at 7.30 p.m. EST uh, by James. And uh, don't forget to follow us on our TikTok, our YouTube, and, you know, all that other fun stuff. Um, Caro, Caro, God damn it, Jessica, would you like to go? I would love to. I'm Caro, hello. Um, I will be playing Gilly Ghislaine, our water Janazi barbarian. Oh, and I'm imaginary Carol on the internet. And then just toss it to someone. Oh, right. Gosh, I'm on fire we're new, today. We're new. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. We're good. Daniel. That's me. Hi, everybody. I'm Dan. You can find me as the Speed of Candy on all of the various internet places. And tonight I will be playing Damascus Silver, the half, half elf bard warlock. He's a lot of things all smashed into one. Uh, who remembers why we're here, unlike other people. <clears throat> Mm. Speaking of which, James. <laughs> Who's that? I think you're throwing it down to the wrong person. God damn that it, Rev, said. will you introduce yourself? <laughs> Varian, whoever you are. Uh, I am James, uh, otherwise known to the internet, depending on where you find me, as Mazrix or Mazrix24. I, I respond to any of those, and also any typical white boy name. You want to call me Steve? We're golden. It doesn't matter. Um, but uh, it's daddy actually. Oh, <clears throat> well, <laughs> daddy. um, well, that's why we're not actually playing Rumors of Magic next weekend because it's Daddy's Day or Father's Day, and that's a good uh, segue. I well, it's just it, it was, that's why. Uh, but um, yes, tonight I will be playing either, I have no idea whether it's gonna stick. Varian Arbor, that asshole who decided to talk instead of me that at the beginning of the conversation, uh, or uh, who's a sorry, he's a storm sorcerer, uh, or uh, alternatively, Varian Arbor, uh, the druid that the party is used to spending time with. Bit of a bit, bit of a contrast there. So I guess we're gonna find out what happens. Uh, and that's that's it for me. I'm just gonna. Feed my addiction, have another chip, and get excited to play our game. All right. So, last time in AA, episode 61, A Town Forgotten. The game began with an unexpected twist as the DM threw James into the spotlight, having him roleplay as both Arev and Varian during their initial encounter. It was captivating. It was a captivating start that set the tone for an amazing session, if I do say so myself. Um, subsequently, Varian managed to embarrass Winter to an extreme degree. <laughs> this poor, poor man. Uh, while Talon intruded upon Gilly in her room. As the party continued their journey, they stumbled across a forgotten village of Aztua, nestled within the dense Rayan jun jungle. Jungle. Curiously, Varian experienced a lapse in memory, adding to the intrigue to adding intrigue to their exploration. Disturbing screams drew their attention, leading the leading to a significant revelation when a rev was recognized by Roy, Ray Bella's father. Although the poor little girl's own father failed to recognize her, Damascus skillfully resolved the situation with a swift suggestion spell. Intriguingly, the next their next move was to, you know, leap into the well, causing Gilly to purposely or to forget their purpose. Amidst a lively disco party and a memorable encounter with an el elderly garlic no no, the party 
emerged triumphant. God damn it, Jessica. Learn to read. At the bottom of the well. And uh, that's where we come in. What do? All right. Well, that was something. I suppose it's a start, at least. We should probably figure out what in the hell's causing these things to get all ruckusy and make them you lot forget who in the hell you are and why we're here. Now, just hold on a second there. I- I've never forgotten who I am. And in fact, uh, lovely uh, Gilly there. Did you, uh, kid, come with me for just a second. Uh, we we got to take a couple steps down this hallway. Sure, uh, yeah. Yes, we should definitely be walking down the hallway. The dark, scary oh, hallway. Uh, oh, no, 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 a second, I- okay? Yeah, we, we just need an aside as uh, villagers. We we have to have a quick villager circle. Uh, it's it's no offense, of course. Uh, you could be a villager if you decided to take up a, uh, a residence. I, I hear there's quite the abode available for about four hundred gold just on the outskirts. But just just a quick just shh, just and he like takes. Okay, Gilly. we'll hurry back. Don't don't, and, don't go far. Huddle. And I I grab Faze and I pull her near Winter so we're <laughs> within range of his Wi-Fi in case we have to do another save. <laughs> <laughs> yes, the yeah, Wi-Fi is very probably, important. Probably Paladin <laughs> Wi-Fi is important. Yes, it very much so. Um, as I pull Gilly forward, I go, "What are we gonna do about this crazy lot?" I don't know. He's he's getting awfully familiar with us. I mean, we just met the guy. What? It's not like we just fell down a well with him or anything. It's, it's, he's talking like we we've known him this entire time. And everybody knows you're not supposed to go down the well. This is and a yet, terrible idea. And yet we're down the well. Down here. I don't... Why, why did we get ourselves roped up into this mess? I don't remember. It I seems don't... very out of character for both of us. It does, doesn't it? Huh. Huh. Shall we go on as you guys are As you guys are talking, a small fairy dragon flies over and just rests itself dramatically over um, Carol's... Carol's... Gilly's head. Ah! Right into the hair. <laughs> what the Jesus is that? What's on me? That's not the rock roach, is it? I, it might be. Hang it's on. It's got claws. I uh I don't have a and he's, <gasps> he's like, hang on. And he like pulls uh, a dagger out of his uh Immediately <laughs> Talon <laughs> begins to scurry down the back of your neck and kind of into the back of your shirt. <laughs> Hiding. Oh, I think I think you can get it. It's it's like that carnival game where you just sort of stab it around to places and you try and get the gopher. Hang on, <laughs> and he's like trying to like whack a mole it. <laughs> How many back. hit points do I lose? <laughs> do you want to roll? <laughs> I mean, I mean, I'm down. Dagger's a D four. Go for it. <laughs> you want to make an attack roll? Heck yeah! All right, attacking my own entranced teammate. Let's go. <laughs> I swear, Gilly, I'm only trying to hit the thing on your back if I hit you. Sorry. <laughs> um, as I get all of my dice for this session, which would have been uh, a plan before we actually started, but uh, let's I'm roll. Make your little dice tower. I would love a dice tower. Anyways, I definitely miss because I rolled a six on the dice, and Varian is not particularly dexterous. Uh, uh, it's an eleven. Thank to you hit. for missing. Nope, you're yeah. good. <laughs> Yeah. Did you guys walk far enough away that I can't see you starting to stab at each other? Oh no, That's we're probably like probably. twenty feet away. <laughs> yeah. Like it right. was not that far. I just like started sta- stabbing. Uh, uh, may- maybe it's a very stop obvious stab situation. Stab and, uh, stop stabbing at each other. All right. I promise. It's something in my as shed. you are as you are stabbing at your friend, uh, Varian. A lion kitten lands on your head and Lying tries kitten. to stop you. Pause. Well done, pause. The Tressum. Oh. Alright, now you made the cat mad. There's something Maybe. on you, mate. But yours is cute. Your, I'm not gonna friends, stab that one. That's cute. Well, oh, mine talks. You don't know what he said because he said it in Sylvan. Oh, and right. uh, Faisal will call out <laughs> You're upsetting Talon. Hey, he Talon? says you hurt his feelings. Uh, He's upsetting the, me. That's the dragon. Maybe don't make the little dragon mad. Why don't we continue to proceed down the well, find a way out of here, and then we can all get out your hair. And y'all can go back to living your quiet little life in this quiet little town 
or not, because I'm sure you're going to get your memory back when we defeat whatever the fuck's down here causing this jammer. All right, get out of my shirt, though, Phila. Okay, he okay. climbs back up on the shoulder. Your neck. Yeah. <laughs> and then just Much sits. better. Do you, nice you don't remember to meet nothing? You. Yes, I remember my nice friend Darian. That's, that's a start. Do you remember your friend of Rev? I look at Varian when I say that. See if there's any reaction whatsoever. You can remember oh, Rev. Rev is so. part of you. I, he, I, I, I look at him and go, but how do they knew that? How did you know that? Who is who, you... who is a Rev to you? A Rev's a friend of mine and has been for a couple months now. Okay, well, I'm, I'm going to have to disagree, sir, because I've been in control for the last couple of months, and uh, I have to say that uh, he's never met you. Then how do I know he lives in your head, or you live in his head, if we're being a little more accurate about the situation? I've got many enemies, and I if somebody paid you with knowledge, I did. I, you have I'm many just saying, enemies? Like, you don't, many you? enemies? I mean, don't you? Don't I- you? I don't think so. Aren't I'm enemies not. just those people that you collect that do you favors all the time, and then uh, when they you ask them for help, they help you? Those are your enemies, aren't they? I, I would really think that those are your friends. No, those are your enemies. You gotta keep your enemies close to your friends further. That's Why? Why that would you think... The same. Okay, the same. this has been a good talk. Um... All right, we're gonna we're gonna snap you out of this. Hey, hey, Varian, you remember your, your parents, right? Your mothers? Or, or Rev's I mothers? I think technically those would be your Rev's <laughs> mothers. I'm Thanks, just saying. No, you're, you're absolutely right. Sister. <clears throat> of course I remember my parents. Why wouldn't I remember them? The when red teeth things. Time? Oh my god, I have to roll for that thing on your goddamn chest. <laughs> oh, she's fine. So snap out of it, you dumb shit. <laughs> These are your friends. That's impossible, Miss. Also, the whole oh, situation with you and how you're here and not, you know, dead, that's another thing for stories that I need answers of. So you just... remember the necklace, you just don't remember the rest of us. I'll try not to be offended. <laughs> you're hurting no. the pretty one. You might as well stop now. Anything intelligent hurts the pretty one. I may as well never stop. Oh, Damn, shots fired. <laughs> well, lean over to Way Beza. Harsh tie. Wait, I, I don't know him. Am I not? I think I'm jogging pretty? his memory. Am I? Am I not pretty? I, I, I was literally made by the goddess of beauty. Winter's questioning his whole his whole life. <laughs> his whole you're, shit. You're beautiful. <laughs> no, he's not. Don't say that. Don't give him hope. <laughs> We all need Varian, to, yeah. it, Varian looks over to Winter and just simply does one of these. I, you know, we came <laughs> down here for a reason, and it was because we think a Rev's mother is stuck down here. Right. If you don't remember that, uh, but uh, we got a message from her. So, um. Do you want to help see if your mom is down here? I think it's Ella. That's the reason we're in the well. Yeah. Yeah, it is. That's the reason we're in the well. You think a Rev's mother has somehow got past every villager to come down here somehow. And we did. Be down Well, no. I helped you down here with my darkness spell above the well. Why I did that, of course, I have no idea. So don't be questioning me too deeply. But you somehow think that a Rev's mother is down here. Yeah. Before us. Um, Correct me if I'm wrong. Your mother's, Rev's mother's a talented, skilled ranger. Is she not? You're telling me she couldn't sneak past all them people in the dead of night, make her way down into a well if she wanted to? Who has, you know, like a thing for helping people? So if she found out that something was wrong, she would totally want to try and fix it. 
Uh, hey, that Ella does seem to jump into trouble quite a lot. Uh, not that she'd know, I know that, of course. It would explain um, why the tag is here, too. Sasha's here. Yeah, up, so, up uh, at the top of yeah. the well. Big tiger. I'll minor image what the tiger looks like. Big guy See? up there. I, I know what my cash looks like. Thank you. But so do I. Clearly, I must have met him at some point. Her. Her. It. <laughs> I, I turn again to Carol and I go, sorry for trying to stab you there, Carol, but I was Carol. getting <laughs> <laughs> I started for trying to stab you that I'm getting used to it. Uh, <laughs> I started for trying to stab you there, Gilly. Um, I uh, there's a couple of like, questions that don't seem to be getting answered, though, aren't there? Yeah, I'm uh, I reckon the only way out of the well is through. Um, so if these people are looking for somebody who's lost. I'm fine with helping for now. You know what? Fantastic idea. Uh, Which is, you know, what you said at the top of the well, but then when you fell down, you kind of got like a little shocked. Um, Might have bumped your head or something. Do you remember that? Do you remember hitting your head on the rocks? I've hit my head lots of times. So there you go. Yeah, that tracks. And they say every time you do it, it gets worse than the time before. Gosh, it's a serious business. So really? You should see it clear. Really? <laughs> How would we know no. this otherwise? I have to say, this whole adventuring thing through the well, it actually seems like a fantastic idea to me at this point. So why don't you three uh, go first? And we'll just uh, make sure that... No. I think I'll, yeah. I'll, I'll sure. take up the rear. I'll take no, it no, the no. rear. No, no, no. I, you know, I just love watching you. Oh God, walk away, and um, yeah. I'll, you know, uh, I, I'm, I'm a very confident middle. If you want to be behind me and people that are in front, I'm, I'm, I'll, I'll, I'll take the lead. Okay. Yeah. I'll, I'll just Winter, in case anything comes up behind us. I, I feel like I should, I should be back here. And he awkwardly winks at you. <laughs> Is that how that works? Oh, smart, I love right? him. <laughs> right. Ooh, uh, okay. I fall for that hook, line, or sinker. I rolled a nat 20 on whether I was charmed. Excellent. You okay. fall for... I mean, Winter is gorgeous. He's made by the the queen of beauty herself, so... A pretty, pretty man. And uh, he'll he'll kind of take out his his uh war his forge hammer and just put it over his shoulder and stand behind you guys like whenever whenever we're ready oh. <clears throat> head on in uh i'm gonna cast armor of agathis on myself at fourth level okay because i feel like that's a good idea so, and... have we we established that everybody can see right uh, uh yes see. okay yeah. cool everyone um... can see in the dark I say Except that as though I have any sort of light thing. Are human. I <laughs> um, but yes. So I'm in a human body, but I'm mm-hmm. also t- I'm also Varian right now, and Varian has dark vision. I'll I don't allow think that. that's how that works. I'll allow that. Sure. I'll okay. allow that. <laughs> I'll allow that simply because it is convenient. You can't do anything else of of her revs. <laughs> it's fine. You don't have any of his light stuff. No. I got Jack. You guys are <laughs> down you you guys are down here with and your only healer right now is a paladin. Mm. And me. I have We've got some potions. Yeah, you and got yeah. potions. <laughs> Speaking of which, I just took one. Okie dokie. As we're going. Um, just, just, just a little bit. I mean be fear. At the I'm same probably time, good. We recently had a breakthrough, uh, a Rev and I. So, uh, very <laughs> little Rev. There's a there's a little bit of a Rev. Like uh, he's he's right bubbling below the surface, which he he never used to do before. So he's I'm just in your saying, heart. Maybe if the gods allow it, there might be a divine intervention for him to take over. We'll so... see. We'll, we'll we'll roll for it. <laughs> maybe if somebody dies. <laughs> <laughs> it, it, if it happens, if it happens, we don't know. 
Uh, if someone dies, I think, uh, I actually think um, Winter can do something about that. He's got like a yeah. bead on his necklace or something that can do something. Uh, all right. As you guys continue, can you roll me a perception check as you walk through this kind of almost like underground tunnel? Twenty-three. Ten. And okay, you you don't see anything. You're just like, why are we here? Um fifteen for Varian and like six for no, Winter eight. is just Winter, Winter is just shocked that he got you, you know, to go along with this by flirting, and he is now just realizing the power that he may have. Mm-hmm. Um uh oh. <laughs> But with your uh, 23, you do notice that there are uh, those large drag marks in the dirt, um, Damascus. And they seem to be well used, kind of going back and forth through the cave. I will pause for a second and just gesture to the ground. Do y'all see that? I'm going to say also with a 23, you see a footprint walking down the cave. Small, uh, very dainty boot footprint. That's a good sign. Um, Okay, so I'll point out the drag mark. Something's been dragging itself. uh, Somebody's been dragging something in and out of this here. Well, I ain't looking forward to whatever it is that made that mark. Uh, Hey, Varian... Yes, uh, of course. I don't suppose you'd happen to know the size of a Rev's mother's boot, would you? I, not for a weird reason. I'm just, <laughs> I looked down, I pointed the uh, boot print. Any chance that's hers? Varian just wanna... stares at him <laughs> and stares at him. That's a very interesting question from you coming coming from you sir you want to know if I know the size of my mother's feet I specifically said boot not feet there's a fair you're telling me you read the other your mother's mother. look I, I just I don't want to hear any more of this conversation and he like puts his hands over his ears <laughs> and goes la 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 it is literally trying to like drown out his noise because like, he's just like done with this conversation, uh, covering his ears and like humming as loud as he can. Faisa kind of walks up and like puts a hand over your mouth and is just like, shh, shh, shh. We don't know what's down here. No, that's kind of the point. I was hoping to not hear him, and he is down here. Okay, well, shut up, Damascus. Speaking of, should we be stealthing? That is up to you. Rob, that's probably a good like, idea. Who can say? I feel the need who can to be say? a little stealthy. <laughs> you want to roll let's, for stealth? Sneak the rest of the way on in. I'm oh, stealth. Jesus. I might have to retire these dice. That's uh-huh. That would be another 10. Okay. Well, it doesn't matter, so whatever happens, you, anything that's down here is definitely just going to hear Gilly walking around. <laughs> Damascus got a 26, but uh, Faiso got a 8. Yeah, she's too busy trying to just get um, Varian to come along with you guys. Varian got a... They're just like shuffling and bumping into walls. And... Varian got a 7 and Winter got an 8. Okay, so you guys so... are just <laughs> unable. You're unable to be quiet. You mentioned um, that we should be sneaking. Damascus is like invisible against the walls. <laughs> Everybody else is just like, yeah, we should be quiet. Clank, 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 <laughs> clank, 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 clank. At some point, Winter's Winter bumps into the wall because he's too busy being like, should I be flirting with people in his head? Um, <laughs> it's a disaster. Uh, I feel like Varian just hasn't shut up. He's just like Varian <laughs> hasn't shut up. Faces so trying talking. to get him to shut up. It's just not <laughs> happening. Yeah. Um. 
Uh, you continue. Barian, you have a bardic, just so you know. From nice. <laughs> Josh. Josh. Uh, you, oh, um, thanks, Josh. I- I'm going to save continue that. Continue through the cave. Move on into the cave. You might and um, you come across uh, like a there's an entrance into another cave or you can go forward and continue down the tunnel. What would you like to do? Um, I would like to listen to hear if I hear anything in the other cave. Go make me um an investigation. Perception. I want to, okay. I'm just going to give you what you're good at. Yeah, not this time. Nine. <laughs> okay. Well, you hear nothing. It's quiet. Hmm. Um, are we more than 120 feet away from uh, Nono Garlic? Uh, you have left Nono Garlic. So let me see here. Uh, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, Farewell. 40, 40, 50, 50, 50, 50, 60, 60, 70, 70, 80, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100, 110. Perfect. Uh, message has a range of 120 feet. I okay. point back in the direction of Nono Garlic and I send him a message and go, uh, Howdy, friend. Just a question for you, if you don't mind my asking. Uh, I don't suppose you know what's further down this cave, maybe in this little passageway here? More cave. More cave. Any uh, creatures or more unfriendly fellows like the last ones we had to deal with? Oh, cool. We come and we go. Fair enough. Appreciate the help. Uh, do you want us to, like, invite people down to this cave? Are you happy down here? Do you want us to let the people in town know that you're down here? Maybe hang out with them every new once in a while? There's a pause. It's a little too long, and he goes, I mean, no one's ever asked me that before. I don't want you to be lonely down here. And I know your friend, the, the strobe light, he seems to enjoy partying. I'm sure the kids would love it down here, have a little brave or something. I bet we could have some pool parties. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Once we deal with whatever's down here and make it safe, I'll let the town know we can have a pool party. That would be wonderful, you young whippersnapper. I whisper back to the group. All right. So the garlic don't know anything about what's down here, but once we get out of here, we're going to set him up for some parties and stuff. He gets lonely. Uh, So what are you doing as you have approached this uh, entrance to another part of the cave? Do you continue forward or do you check what's in there? I don't love the idea of something potentially being able to sneak up behind us. (laughs) Although I'm also just a completionist in general. (laughs) Yeah. My video game sense tells me there's a chest in there. (laughs) (laughs) Maybe some pots we can break. Yeah. So explain to me what you're doing. Can Varian, so Varian, against his better nature, starts to sort of like look around. Because like there's been some like discrepancies and he's not exactly an idiot. And so he's going to look at the passage and he's trying to like look at the stone markers themselves and figure from the travel that he's done in his life, like whether there's some clear indication in the cave markers, whether like there's a way that might be the the safer or a more like traveled option, and if there was a way to do so. Uh investigation. Investigation? Okay. That's how to convince you for survival. Uh, Maybe he'll find an onion wife. Aww. <laughs> it's yes. Um, unfortunately, because it, this is an investigation check, I only rolled an eleven. Um, you will notice that most of the cave looks like it has been traveled frequently. By what? <laughs> Something big. Mm. That's what you get. Otherwise, who can say? Who can say? Who can say? So I don't know yeah. who'd uh, who who'd be able to say this. You know who could who can say this? In fact, but uh, uh, it's at least something large that's been coming back through this space. I think it makes sense to me that if we're going into this cave, I don't want to be snuck up from behind by anything. 
let's clear the place out properly. Let's check what's in there and then move on. Who knows? Maybe we'll find a very, maybe we'll find a Rev's mother holed up somewhere. Uh, you know exactly where a Rev's mother is. Yes, but I, I know. I also want to convince these two <laughs> okay. who don't know what's going on. Uh, all right, all I'll right. I'll venture in. I'll go first. All right, I'll go first. You y'all stay close behind. Come I'll be right behind you with my tried and doubt. All right. So he, are you you're going in with him right away? Sure thing. Okay. <laughs> you're like you say that, and they're just like, we don't trust you. Uh, and you, kind of, <laughs> you guys all kind of go in together. Uh, when you do, I'm gonna need everyone to roll me wisdom saving throws minus. Oh, a D4. great. <laughs> minus a D what? Four. Okay. Four. Jeez, okay, I'm switching my dice out. Oh no, did, did okay. Winter wisdom? come with us? Winter? Yes, God winter is behind you. <laughs> uh, you're probably about, you're, you're still in his range. It's 10 feet, right? That's his range? Yeah. What do we get if we're in his okay. range? Uh, plus five. Okay, wait. <laughs> yeah, I rolled good. How's an eight sound? How's an eight sound? <laughs> oh, okay, Gilly, you're still like... Why am I even here? In fact, you trip for a second um, and are like, what did I just stumble over and look around and there's nothing there? Hmm. How's it? James, you said that Varian's not an idiot and he's trying to figure things out. Gilly is an idiot. So the- <laughs> <laughs> this ain't going to go You still remember why you're here. Varian oh. got a three. A three. No clue. Okay, so you and Gilly are just in the same, like, you did the same trip. And uh, Damascus, for a second, for a second, you swear you could have felt someone breathing on your neck. And when you turn around, there's nothing there. I mean, FaZe is not even close enough to you to do that. What? What, Did did Mm FaZe get anything? FaZe got a nat one. Okay, Uh... nothing. She actually did the same thing and tripped and then was like, I just, I literally just fell over my own feet, I think. Um, I look at the ground. Winter got an 18. Ground. Okay, okay, okay. Winter got an 18. Winter is in the same place as Damascus. Um, as you As you look at the ground, Damascus, there are bones strewn throughout the dark, damp cave. Uh, you're in a large semicircular room with bones littering the floor, piles of them. Um, it looks like there may be uh, like piles of like discarded items that are just thrown into the corners and um, the middle of it of this room has been cleared almost like a nest maybe. But that's that's it. That's what you see. Does it look shiny in the center of the room with things? It just looks like a dark room with a lot of bones everywhere. Somebody knows something about a D&D monster. <laughs> Me? Hmm? No. I don't, I, I don't know shit. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> um, I will point out the bones. Uh, I think we found whatever the hell lives down here's nest. Ah. Uh, I did God, not notice this not at all. Oh, I'm pretty sure it is. I felt no, the breath course. on my neck probably from further down in the cave. Oh, no, of course, of course it's not. Look at the empty you, fucking room. You were in here, though. We could be as loud as we want. And Varian begins to, like, <laughs> take, t- t- breathe in and goes... <laughs> Before he can say a word, I clap the second he starts breathing in. <laughs> He gets out that first uh, (laughs) before you shut the fuck up. (laughs) You feel both of you feel a breath. Something something hot and foul smelling just breathes down on you. And then you look around and there's nothing there. And we look quiet up. You look up. Uh Uh-huh. And as you look up, there's darkness. Right. What do you do? Well, bones aren't going to help us much. Should we just move on, I guess? I guess. Um, let me try something. 
I'm going to. Oh, I can't do mine or. Okay, that's okay. I'm going to do cast light on my sword. Okay. To illuminate this place a little bit. Uh -huh. And I'm going to hold it aloft and I'm going to go, all right, everyone, look around the room, but don't look for something in it. Look for a weird shadow. And I would like to look around and see if I see anything's shadow. Okay. Okay. okay nice. Okay. Uh, give me an investigation checks. Can we all do it? Yeah, go for it. Yeah. That's more like it. 15 for Damascus. 18 for Gilly. 15, 18, okay. Um, uh, uh, not one for Varian, because not I refuse... One. I refuse to be useful during my own arc. <laughs> it's just... fine. You know, with your nat one, you look around and you kind of just stumble over something again. You know, you're having a real hard time down here. You're not sure why. And Winter Basically got a six. Got a Basically got a 21. Same with Winter. Winter tripped over something for like the first time. Uh, with an 18, you swear you felt something on your neck. You thought you swear something was breathing. Maybe you heard like a little <laughs> laugh. Oh, um, I don't like this. With a 15 Damascus. Yeah. This is there's nothing here. There's nothing here right now. With a 21. Faze looks around, goes, I thought I saw a shadow, maybe. I don't know. It's gone now. Where did you see it? Uh, and she kind of looks, she does a another spin, and uh, I need a a wisdom saving throw minus a d4. Uh, 17 plus 3 is 20, plus 2 is 22. Oh, minus a d4. Wait. Mm -hmm. 17 minus 3 is 14. Plus two is 16, plus Winter's thing is 21. And she... Okay. I... There's... There it is again! And she circles the room again. I think it's... No, it's not here. God damn it. Uh, just really want you to understand that I have also homebrewed this monster more. <laughs> and I'm so sorry. Uh, terrifying and I love it. Oh, good. <laughs> Ooh. Okay. Do I... In the rubble, like the bones, do I see any discarded torches? There are torches. Yeah. So, the prestidigitation cantrip says, I instantly light or snuff out a candle, torch, or small campfire. Okay. So if I saw that Damascus was, like, sort of, like, sort of this light or whatever, Varian, having been muffled previously, um, but not one to be sort of shown up, kind of look, mumbles under his breath, okay, they're a pretty boy. If you want to start a show of lights, <laughs> we can do that. And he just starts, like, picking out as many torches as he, as he can see, and he just goes, there's light. And there's light, and there's light, and he's just like snapping these torches uh, until they are cascading light around the room, uh, but purely egotistically, just to be like, "Oh, you're not the only one that can cast light around here now, can you?" <laughs> uh, As you, I'll okay. You know what? With this, all the light turns on in this room, and. Okay. Uh, when you do that, I need, for just a split second, all of you begin to see this creature with five, was it five or six? Hang on. Fingers crossed for five. Uh, with, um, I believe it's six. Six 
heads with almost human heads, all right? They've got these big yellow teeth in a giant joker smile, big oh. wide eyes that look like they have no um, eyelids on them with beady just watching you. And this, they're attached to these long slithering necks that come down into a singular blob of a body with a long tail and it's pallid it's white it's disgustingly slimy and stench filled in here it looks at you and one of the heads laughs and another one laughs and then one of them opens and this haunting melody begins and another one joins it before you hear a uh, one right in the middle I need everyone to roll the wisdom saving throw Ooh. minus a D4. Um, and then we're going to roll initiative as one of these heads begins to reach for you. 11. 11. Okay. Next. Nine for Varian. For, um, for the wisdom save anyways. Okay. Nine. Winter got a 17 for the wisdom save. 17. Okay. Daniel, you're muted. I'm going to use a luck point because I rolled a two on the dice and I don't like that. Beza um, got a 17 total with Winter's bonus. And you? Luck point. Uh, that's much better. Uh, 16 with winter's bonus all right so damascus phase and winter in front of you is what we like to affectionately call a false hydra um as for the others at the beginning of each one of your turns, you are going to need to roll a wisdom saving throw, DC of 15. If you do not pass that, you do not see this creature this round. Okay? The others, you will need to roll that every, like, three rounds. Okay? Good, good. Okay. good. <laughs> so... Please remember that bit for me of which one you have to do, because I will probably forget. We we only don't see it, or do we have an inability to be aware of it, even if people You don't us? even know it's there. You don't know what they're fighting. You don't know what's hurting you or hurting them. Nothing. Huh. Okay. It is gone for that round. I love so. being useless. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> um... Will you please set your characters up where they are in this room? Okay, I came in right behind Damascus. Damascus. Yeah, Damascus was right up in the mix, I think. Faza was beside you. Winter was back here. Uh, Winter would have been close enough that we all got his James? Wi-Fi, right? Awesome. So he's got to be yeah. a little bit closer. So I, I would, right I would have are, the right squares, are the squares five feet on this? Yes, they are. Okay, so uh, let's roll for initiative, everyone. Right. Gilly. Oop. Uh, what's 14 plus 7? 21. Thank you. Yeah, 21, yeah. 21. Plus 7 uh, initiative. Baller. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Got a Damascus. Uh, Damascus got a 21 as well. Okay, who has uh, the higher decks? Minus 16. Uh, yeah, mine's uh, 14. Dex. 14. Okay, so you will go at 20 then. Uh, Arev or Varian. Varian, what you got? Oh, I just, uh, I'm just going to be taking my time before I go anywhere near anything that uh, these people <laughs> think they're fighting. Anyways, I got a four. A four. All right. All right. Faza. Uh, 13. 13 and winter. That would be a cool dex bonus of uh, 19. 19. Nicely done. Okay. This one goes there, and we will enter that all in. Mr. Garlic will no no goes away. 
All right, oh, no. so you should be able to see. Farewell. One second. Where everyone goes, let me unhide that. And there's your false hydra. Let's begin. Big fella. Damascus. Okay. So, it, sorry, just before we begin. Uh, so this room is only like 25 feet across-ish. It's a very small pit. Yeah, it's only a little like nest that it's in. Oh, well, it's, shit. It's something nice and cozy. 35 at the at like the, the longest of it. Uh I'm I'm screaming in uh squishy mage. Okay, continue. <laughs> <sighs> All right. Damascus, uh, what you doing? Damascus will. I do not have a lot of spells left. Um Damascus is cantripping this fight. Uh, he's still holding concentration on suggestion to make sure that uh Oh my God, Remember that your next hit is a crit because oh. of your garlical friend. Ray Bell. Thank you for reminding me. Yeah, uh, for the little. In that case, I am going to walk right up to this big hydra and take a swing at the closest head and try and go choppy chop with my fancy sword, casting um, Belloth's Brilliant Blade. Eh. Yeah, Belloth's Brilliant Blade as I do. A butterfly blade. Yeah. Uh, so that is one swing. Does a 24 hit. 24 hits? Oh, sorry. Five heads, by the way. Five. And that's a crit. Yep. So what do you got? Uh, that's going to be just double checking. So. Uh, 2d8 for my sword, 5th level melee attacks, and then 2d8 radiant damage for the brilliant blade. So that is 4d8, 38. Uh, that is here, 8, 10, 13. 18 plus do, 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 sorry uh 18 plus 7 is 25 damage 25 damage as you hit it Damascus do you want to describe what it looks like or oh that's you damn it and it's fine I Continue. light up my sword it glows with energy and I move forward and just slice right across the throat of this thing cutting into its neck leaving a gushing wound at the side of it as you cut into one of its necks another one of these heads screams this haunting horrifying and then laughing as comes out of one of them and you take five psychic damage ow ow it hurts my head when i hit it oh. um is that your turn um not yet. Oh. Can I say that I it's too late. Damn it. Uh I meant to cast a spell first that would have given me an extra 48 damage. Next next time. Oh well. Um then my bonus action will be um do I notice that uh Gilly and or Varian are not noticing this thing? I'm gonna say you'll have to go through a round before you do. Okay. Because it's appeared so suddenly. Okay. And it's then, so big and around you and how did you not even see it? Alright. Then I'm just gonna go uh, Gilly, fork the damn thing. And I'll give you Bardic Inspiration. Oh my gosh, thank you. Uh, that's a D D eight to oh, no. ability check, oh, attack roll, or saving throw. Bardic. Um. Okay. Then, movement. Go I ahead. Float. I do this with my movement. You flare your cape, and you're I plus two, cape. I believe. Yes. Okay. Uh, Gilly, it is your turn. Your turn. Okay, so I can't see what it is, but I know that a fight is happening, right? Like I've seen Damascus attacking something. Yes. I would like to call my little friend to come out and play with me. 
my spectral octopus. Okay. Yay. How does he this appear? Is so what exciting. does he look like? Um, I think he's one of those... Uh, I actually, I looked up some octopus references, right, when you gave me this thing, okay. and there's some octopuses that are, like, transparent. Yes. And so he, I think he's one of those, and he's probably, like, how big should he be? Maybe, like, my size-ish, if you count okay. the arms. And he's just, like, bloop, bloop, floating bloop, in the air. Floating in the behind air. Behind me, like, I'm ready to rumble. Um... Can my octopus perceive the false hydra? Should I roll, uh, roll for, for it. my octopus? Okay. Roll for it. Yeah. Wisdom. Let me, let me get him up there. What is your wisdom? Plus zero. We got a decent. I could roll a 15. I didn't, though. I rolled an eight. Okay. So me, <laughs> me and my little octopus friend. Octopus is like, what the hell? But you know what? I'll say that because it's an animal, they kind of have like a danger sense. It's on its edge. Yeah. Like it's it's not happy here and it it knows something's wrong. And I like would it be fair to ready an action with mm-hmm. my trident out for if I see something? Go for or it. If you something have prepared is obvious, an action. You're prepared to I will to attack. stab it with my big fork. Yes. Okay. Okay. Yes. <laughs> you have prepared your thing. Okay. Is that all you're doing this turn? I I guess so. Okay. Uh, Maybe I'll try wait. to, you know what? I might try to move off, like, up, like, there. Just try and, like, spread us out a little bit more. Yeah, that's perfect. That's great. Fantastic. Right. You're just, you know, you get, you kind of, like, you know something's wrong. You're not sure what's what's happening. You got your, your trident out. It's close to your body. You're holding it. You're backed up against a wall. Like, at least nothing's going to attack you from back there. Yeah. You know? And I've got my octopus friend just... And your octopus friend is almost like it's starting to um, <laughs> crawl around you and hold on to you, prote- almost like it's protecting Gosh. you, holding on, um, because it's nervous. Aquatic uh, thunder shirt. <laughs> <laughs> um, after that, I believe it is Winter's turn. What does Winter do? Uh, be deeply uncomfortable <laughs> to start off. As he, as <laughs> deeply he, uncomfortable. As- as he normally is. So are we fighting this thing? Um, and he's got a roll. <laughs> <laughs> One of the heads laughs as it kind of wiggles toward him. I hate please the laughing. It, <laughs> the laughing is so bad. <laughs> um, he doesn't hear the laughing because with my terrible ass luck, uh, Winter rolled a three. You were you're okay for this round. You that that what you rolled for that wisdom saving throw was this round. Oh oh oh. Okay, he's good. So then, um, you said we have to roll every three rounds, right? Uh, for people who saw it originally, I'm gonna say every three rounds. For people who didn't, you have to roll every round. Every round. Okay. So then, Winter will. It's actually supposed to be every round, but I I feel really bad. <laughs> <laughs> oh, don't. No, no, this Run is it fun. properly, man. If we die, we die. <laughs> if we, I mean, if, if you want to do it that die. way, it is every round. So every round you have to roll to see if you see it. Um, And that's just it. That's like the 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 stats that I found for that one. That I didn't change that bit. Um, so I think what Winter's going to do is Winter is going to uh stay put but he's kind of gonna reach out to or no he'll he'll move a little bit forward so he's gonna move into this space over here uh where he's a little bit closer to people other than Gilly and he's just kind of gonna reach his hands out and be like this is new but just you know Go with it. And he puts his hands out and Frost begins to rhyme up his arms uh, until his fingers literally freeze in the air. And it looks like he's crunching and snapping his fingers until he finally closes them into palms and the ice bursts forward from his fists until these shards go into uh, a radius sphere ahead of him as he casts at third level um, Spirit Guardians. Ice. Ice. And okay. 
so uh, he, he takes these shards and as he cracks them and they go flying out, they actually almost look like the tiny um, bodies of butterflies that uh, the, the, the bodies are made of sort of the crystalline ice and the wings themselves are sort of a frigid air that come, kind of coalesce and swirl as these butterflies all take the space. And he looks over to Damascus and goes, shut up, it has nothing to do with you. And like, because <laughs> Bomb's whole thing is like butterflies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But he's sort of borrowing this this image in his head from from his brother, right? As he call, calls these guardians, these spirit guardians of, of something that helps him feel safe. And he's borrowing this image of Bomb as he cracks this ice into the air. And uh, the spirit guardians say that uh, as long as Winter maintains concentration, anyways, for up to 10 minutes, uh, because he is uh, a lawful good, I believe, thing, uh, these sort of angelic fey butterflies here are going to hover around this creature, which I designate. Uh, so this false hydra, being the only creature that I designate in the affected area, uh, says that whenever uh, an affected creature's speed is halved in the area, and when the creature enters the area for the first time on a turn, or starts its turn there, it must make a wis wisdom saving throw. So I'm turning the tables. Uh, it must make wisdom saving throws now. Uh, uh, on a or... failed save, on a failed save, it takes 3d8 radiant damage. Uh, on a successful save, it takes half as much. Okay. Okay. Yeah, nice. Okay, remind me when it's its turn, and I will do that 100%. Wisdom saving throws. We'll do that. What, uh, let me see if I can put this here. Wiz. Bro. Okay. Fuck. Cool. So, it does it take damage this turn? Uh, That's a good question. I think Spirit Guardians is, uh, says... Only on the start of its turn. Yeah, it's it's just at the start of its turn, so it's sort of like a setting up like a like a, tra a trap area, if you will. Yeah, like Moonbeam. Okay, cool. No, okay, is that his turn? Uh, because he doesn't have any decent bonus actions, I don't think. So, yeah, that's it. Okay, um, Faza. Uh, Faza. Who sees it? Sees it. This turn, at least. Oh my god, I don't like this! This is so disgusting! What is it? And she will just, kind of panicked, just cast Sickening Radiance on it. Just, ah! Okay. Light it up, uh, creating an area of dimish green light that just, um, and she'll burn the sorcery points to make it not hurt the rest of us. Which I believe careful spell is just one. <clears throat> and then it needs to do a constitution saving throw. Sorry, the first time it moves into the area or starts its turn there. So basically when it starts its turn, a whole bunch of shitty things are going to happen to it. Okay. It'll have to do a con save doing 4d10 radiant damage. Okay. Um, Is that her turn? Okay. All right. Uh, yeah. We move on to the false hydra. Wisdom that save. Is laughing mm -hmm. and con singing. Save. <laughs> Let's do a wisdom save and a con save. All right. So wisdom is it's wisdom is plus four and his con is plus four. All right. Yeah. Okay. So 14, 15, 16, 16 for the wisdom. Uh. <laughs> Seventeen is winter save DC. Okay, so nice. what happens? Three D eight radiant damage. As these butterflies, butterflies, butterflies begin to descend on one of the heads, they start, you know, attacking it with this radiant energy. How much damage does it take? Uh, it takes twelve radiant damage. Um, and it, right uh, I I feel like it's like as as the butterflies are like coming down, um, th they sort of like alight on the skin of the false hydra, and as they sit there, like the frost just begins to like seep into the skin, but then they sort of like burst. They're like like little frost bursts, uh, because it's remaining in the space. Mm -hmm. 
and more take their place. And as it, as you know, they burst and it hurt it. And it's constantly like, there's this like echoing, like almost, it's not a, quite a scream. It's not quite like a, you know, when someone sings something like really high, like a high note, it's just like this, something you feel in your bones. You're shaking for a second there as it makes you take some damage psychically and uses a reaction by the way it has two reactions a turn right now well, okay that's too as many. long as it's got all its heads too many okay so eight psychic damage okay as it wails and you feel it in your bones please also do a concentration save for me for that spell absolutely uh not 20 not 20 you're oh, good yes. you're fine it's great Okay, con save. What a waste. <laughs> that is 20, 21, 22, 23. I can't forget. Yes, it rolled Damascus a 19. Will, Damascus will cast... Uh, uh, no, I don't think so. Try that again, you stupid five-headed piece of crap. <laughs> uh, Tell I'm going to cast... 17, 18, uh, 19. It oh, damn it. Uh, that silver barbs, yeah, right? Is, yeah, yeah, I cast silver barbs. Okay. Um, okay, I'll give myself the advantage... Let me mark off that spell before I forget. Uh, does this take half damage? No, but it's oh, still. But Gilly also so has to do it advantage, right? No, Gilly has Bardic Inspiration. Bardic. Okay, cool. Yes. yes. Continue. Yeah, and I have advantage now. Actually, you know what? I'll give. Um... Now you know what I'm going to keep advantage. Sorry, I'm going to be selfish. Um, okay. Okay. So nothing happens then, Lynn. All right. So, as a bonus action, the false Hydra, one of the heads begins to sing. <laughs> so, let me see what this does. Additional singing. Uh, ba, ba, ba. All right. So, as long as it's singing, it's got, like, you will constantly forget that it's there. Okay? We'll, we'll roll each time for it. I'm so scared for you. Like, I, I'm so scared for you. Um, <laughs> Knew I should have and... taken silence. I was debating it, too. <laughs> I couldn't help you. Not um, good. And for its action, it has a multi-attack. Let's see here. Each head fun. that is not singing on its turn. All right, so you have four attacks coming at you guys. As each one of these heads that is not singing lunges forward. And I'm going to say that it is a, it's going for the people that have heard it and can see it. So Gilly, you're good right now. Excellent. Um, and winter. winter, so winter. And uh, you know what? I'm going to roll high or low and it goes either for Gilly or for, no, it's seen you do magic. It's smart. All right, it's gonna hit Varian as well. Let's uh, let's roll these attacks. Um, has, Varian done, has Varian done magic? He turned on all the lights. Mm. Bite attack with each head. Okay, so first one, Damascus, eighteen to hit. Eighteen does not hit, and I would does like to insult hit. it. Is that all you got? Please, it's pathetic. All right, you'll take you'll take variants. <laughs> I'm trying. That's exactly what I'm trying to do. Which is a six. You just infuriate it, and it gives you another attack, which is another know. six. Please, this is just sad now. Like honestly, just walk away. That one, that one hits. That one hits. And I don't have a reaction right. to shield, so I'll let it hit. With that last, it's your mama. <laughs> With that last <laughs> hit, take a lot of hits from your mama. Bam. <laughs> Um, Never mind. you take 10 damage, piercing damage, all right, as okay. it bites you. But that's that's it, it's not that bad, right? Right, totally. All right, except, except you know, it has a trait now. Oh, no, that it's gonna use okay. Uh, it has this innate spell casting that it can do at will, okay. And, um, Damascus. First, a uh, con save to keep up. Oh, no, that's Faza. Ooh, you're fucking lucky. I should <laughs> do a con save for suggestion. 
Um, oh no! Ooh, yeah, but it also takes twenty damage because I still have armor of Agathis up, so it armor takes twenty of Agathis, cold damage. Twenty cold damage. Okay. Uh, it since it does have its wail back, it will wail back at you uh, as you hit it. Another one of its heads scream, um, and you take five psychic damage. Five psychic damage. Armor of Agathis is gone now. Right, Fezzi, you can you can shield me next time. <laughs> I don't want to do anything but leave. Um. So, you've done your thing. I'm gonna need you to do a. Oh, oh! Can you be charmed? Uh, I have advantage against being charmed. Okay, so um, I'm going to need unless a... what. Some paladins have a thing that lets them stop their allies from being charmed. I don't know if Winter does. Um, I don't think so. Let's find out. I don't think this one does. I'm totally checking his character sheet. No. No. Damn. Then I have advantage against it, but I can't be charmed. So roll me a wisdom saving throw or be charmed. Okay, so I get advantage. If one of those is in that one. I'm going to use the 13 plus 5 is 15. And where is Winter? Winter's right behind me. 20. 20. Oh, you just beat it. Just you beat feel... it. 20. Yeah. You Oof. feel something begin to just wiggle into the back of your head where you're just like, no, no, you don't wanna you don't wanna hurt it. You it's not Nothing. it's not gonna hurt you. It's 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 Nothing. it's friendly, right? It's friendly. But then you shake your head and you hear its laugh. <laughs> and you're like, No, that is not friendly. <laughs> not friendly. <laughs> and you are fine this turn. Um I did succeed on my suggestion saving throw, awesome. by the way. So her dad yeah, still loves her. <laughs> a rev. Varian. I have a, I have used a rev Varian in here, so me uh, <laughs> bad. Um this point just don't call me George. I think we're okay. Okay, no, not George. Would you like to uh try and do anything on your turn? I'd love to, so let me uh let me roll for that. Yeah, this dice has been a little bit kinder today, so I'll use this one. Look at that little bun he has and the little curly curls. It's the cutest. <laughs> oh, the little bun. Uh, little bun. So anyways, I've got no fucking clue what's going on today because uh, I rolled uh, another fantastic uh, four plus my You didn't have to roll this two. turn. It's, we haven't gone around yet, this first um, thing. Varian's so. never seen it. Yeah, so you don't know. You, oh, you know so people you are attacking, know. but you don't know why or what's there. But I thought if we hadn't seen it yet, we roll every turn. And then if you have seen it, you roll That's every the, three, right? Starting that. Yes. Or is it up? Is it opposite? We, we're still in our first round going through. Oh, this. oh, you went going forward. <gasps> okay. Yeah, yeah. You've already <sighs> rolled for this round. So uh, Varian kind of looks around and goes, Is there something going on? What, 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 why are you all doing whatever you're doing? This is, this is a bit odd. Oh my God, it's so ugly. <laughs> we're going to Just... die. I think they're you fighting can't... something. You can't right. see it. If there's anything you can do to help us fight or to help yourself next, uh, when you, and you hear this the beautiful thing. song oh, in your head, nothing is there. What's happening? I see, you know, I swear there's something. Y'all are freaking nuts. I swear there's enough light in here, but apparently, <laughs> apparently you're all blind. So let me just uh, let me just help with the light a little bit more, uh, just in case. And uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to meta magic, uh, alter my spell Storm Sphere, and okay. I I'm going to uh, turn it into a Radiant Sphere using Transmute Spell to try and uh, put some light, the, the, more more light than I would know what to do with. Because I'm like, well, you're all fucking nuts, but here's the light anyways, and I just like. Throw this storm sphere like absolutely into the middle uh, of the room because people are telling me something's ugly and over there, but I can't see shit. So I'm like, you're nuts. Let's go. And trying to prove them wrong, cast this uh, spell. 
So a 20 foot radius sphere of whirling <laughs> air and radiance uh, is going it's not to gonna hit any of you guys. It, the it's room's going... not very big. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So so a 20 it's foot radius. radius. That'll hit all of you, won't it? Uh, yeah. fr- from a point of my. Just do it. Well, from from a point of my thing. So, like, if I point at the Ten back of the this. cave, okay, then twenty feet actually doesn't get any of us. I, I'm pointing to the back of the cave. It will hit. It will hit. I think Damascus and Faza. That, that circle you just drew is di- is twenty foot diameter, not radius. Radius is from the center to an edge. It's double that size. Oh yeah, yeah. but like, but the thing is, I I was trying to get to like because the map doesn't include. If you the... do, if you do right at the at the cave wall. Yeah, like at the cave wall is like the epicenter. So like uh-huh, this was like this was yeah, okay. this was half of it. In my it will head. hit it will hit Damascus, I believe, and Faza. Damascus for sure. Faza, no. Yeah. Like yeah, no, that. it'll hit Damascus and Faza, I think. Okay. But other than that, you should be okay. Ooh, it's gonna hit Gilly. Yeah, I was thinking. Yeah, it's gonna hit Gilly as well. You two are back far enough that it won't hit you. It'll hit the others, I believe. Okay. So, uh, all right. So, fair uh, enough. Do it. Gilly and Damascus will, will get it a little bit, but like, I'm I'm trying to not, you know, get us. I'm just like, well, it's the back of the cave. Let's see what's yeah, going you know, on. You're just like, what the fuck is happening? Basically, these people yeah. are weird. So, if I'm hitting my friends, like, sucks to suck. I'm sorry. Get out of the way. <laughs> um, I mean, they're not your friends. You didn't think yeah, you, you barely hit know. Gilly. Yeah. It's, hitting... it's almost just yes. not hitting Gilly. So, Actually, you know um, what? If you make sure that it hits Faza for sure, it cannot hit Gilly. Because she's barely <laughs> getting touched by it. I'm oh, strong. No. It can hit me. It's Gil- fine. <laughs> Gilly's fine. I, I see Gilly I'm not worried about because in this thing I I technically know her, right? Like uh-huh. Uh-huh. a little bit of buffeting air and light. I'm like, oh, Gilly's got this. She's had a harder night last Friday when she was talking to Seamus. Uh and like <laughs> this is just sort of like the my inner monologue. So the the whirling buffet of air uh, takes place in this sphere, and each creature in the sphere, when it appears or that ends its turn there, must make a strength saving throw or take two d six bludgeoning damage. It's fine, nat twenty. It doesn't even move. Its heads don't move. They're still you don't see it, but they're still laughing and singing and coming towards you. And oddly enough, though, it's really fucking loud. And I'm going to give everyone advantage on their wisdom saving throws next turn. Nice. Hey, because it does make a lot of noise. Yes. With the sphere. Um, so anyways, yeah. G- Gilly and Damascus, you'd have to make the strength saving throws, please. Mine was 15. And Faza. And Faza, right? Faza. Uh, no, Faza's out of it. Okay. I-, I hate Gilly and Damascus, but not Faza. Go for it. Uh, Damascus failed hard. That is a okay. two. Seven with Winter's thing. Does a 15 right. pass? Um, what's your DC? A 15 does not pass. Uh, 17 is my DC. Okay. okay, so you guys take that damage. You take nine points of bludgeoning damage. Ow. Sorry. Sorry, what the hell? And <laughs> does your... Is it just a melee attack for your armor of Agathis? Uh, it's gone. My AC it's is gone. gone. Okay. But yes, it okay. is just melee attack. Um, anyone who's got... Uh, do you have any con- concentration spell? Yep, do it. Um, Yeah, I'm good. I've got a okay. 14 target. Cool, cool, cool. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. So uh, it does say that uh, as a bonus action on my turn, as long as I maintain the spell, I can make a, like a lightning bolt strike, but with my transmute meta magic, instead of it being a lightning bolt, it's going to be like a like a rainbow <laughs> it's, it's gonna be like prismatic light it'll just sort of like be like a of like rainbow out of this storm uh oh, of shit. light i oh, know that was a save okay yeah go face it. the rainbow it's uh, a care bear stare it is a care bear <laughs> right. stare yes it is a beautiful rainbow of light uh almost like looking through a prism yes however i cannot do this uh as long if i can't see the thing so uh yeah oh it, it with the spell in the description it actually says creatures within 30 feet of the sphere have disadvantage on wisdom perception checks made to listen yes so, so is that why that's why you're giving us advantage to 
on the thing, yeah. Right? Uh, I'm gonna let you because it's not exactly. Hmm, yeah. Okay. Yeah. So disadvantage to listen. Yeah, I'll give you advantage then to pass, or we can just do it straight. We'll uh, we'll take away the d4. Which would you prefer? I'd prefer advantage. 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 All right, we'll give you advantage yeah. to pass these uh, while that yes. is on. Okay. Um, uh, and then I'm just going to back up a little tiny bit. I'm going to just move myself just behind Winter, and I'm going to remind myself just how beautiful that man is when you see him as you move past him. And that's the end of my turn. All right. Uh, I'm going to roll for something to see if it happens. Suspicious. Okay. 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 Um, let's see here. Top of the round, Damascus. Wisdom saving throw. With advantage. Yes, minus With a d4. Advantage. Minus a d4. Okay. Roll your d20s and then minus a d d4 from whatever you take. Mm -hmm. And 16. No. 15. No, god damn it. I forgot to add my actual modifier. 17. 17. You still see it. Okay. What would you like to do? Right fucking there. I want to get out of the stupid spear that just got cast on me, but it's right in my face. So. Oh, make I... a strength saving throw. Oh. Yep. Okay. Because right. you started your turn uh, there. Ooh. I'm so strong. 17 plus <laughs> uh, oh, winter. So you pass. 23. Cool. I'm used to it now. Um, <laughs> I'm going to swing at this thing. Um, I'm going to... In the wind, you hear... Why does it say this is concentration? <laughs> so I have a thing called branding smite, which is like a bonus action to add a smite to my thing, but it's this concentration. I guess I can't do that and keep my suggestion. That's you cannot. Never mind then. That's dumb. Um, in that case, I'm going to do this with disadvantage. Uh, that changes my plan a little bit. Um, I'm a warlock. <laughs> you Blast. don't. You don't. Eldritch Blast. I, you don't like my my uh, my marionette lap. <laughs> No. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't. Stop it. <laughs> Fuck these things. What did you get? Uh, disadvantage. Six plus 12, 18. How about plus 12 18. to hit? Man. To hit? Yep. You hit? Okay. First one hits. I'm just going to roll this. Actually, no, I'm going to do that first. Um, That's going to do... Okay. 13 damage on the first hit, and it's going to be pushed back 10 feet because of uh, Repelling Blast. Okay. Oh. Repelling Blast. Da, 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 da. It can see. only be pushed back 5 feet. but Yeah, it can only go back that wall. far, but it's up against the wall. Perfect. That gives me enough room to get out of the stupid Storm Sphere, so I'm just going to move up here a little bit. Uno just so I'm Mike. out of it. You know let me just check something. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, can, uh, continue while I read something, sorry. And then uh, I am going to hit it with my second one, which I'm rolling straight now because it's not within five feet of me. Uh, oh, that hits. Uh, 18 plus a very high number. I really have to pay attention to all of the stuff that I have. Uh, that's going to hit 30. 30. Okay. Um, Damascus. Does... Do you want the damage first? Yeah, go. 10 damage. 10 damage. 10 damage. 10 damage. All right. All right. Uh, why did that not go down? Apply the damage. Okay, there we go. Um, Damascus. Fuck, never mind. It's not it's not far enough yet. Okay. Uh I'm gonna make sh it is gonna scream at you though, because you're a bitch and it hates you. That's so another one just... of these things. Jeez. It got it its turn and it mm. got its reactions back. I forgot. Uh, my... My... If if that's um, another yeah, Sonic. 
if, if that's another sound based thing because it of is the not listening? It's, it's psychic oh. um so this so you take uh you take four psychic damage but as you do that one of its heads kind of the one that you cut just kind of wobbles a bit on its neck and crack falls off hangs for a second and falls to the floor yeah, it's wrecked a little one less down powerful. five to go four to go um let's see let me make a note for myself four heads four damage okay uh gilly roll for me um all yes. right. Wait, hang on. I what? Have, I have a bonus action and things still. Uh, bonus action, I will give a rev a bardic. Okay. Or varian, excuse me, bardic. Um, I'm just trying to make sure. Would you actually see the goddamn thing we're trying to fight, please? <laughs> and yeah, and I have a bardic. bardic. I guess I should use. Yeah, you can add it. Is bardic That's... one that we have to declare we're adding beforehand? Or I we... will uh... let you add it. I will let you add it uh, if you roll first and see if you think that okay. you got it. Because I already have advantage on this one, right? So, yep. Jesus, I'm going to need it. Okay, Indeed. so that was plus. I'm so bad at math. Okay, so 12. Do you want to just call it to me? No, I'll I'll add it for, it for you? now. 12 plus 7. 12 19. Plus 7 is 19. Yep. Do I see it? You do. How exciting. You do. Right. You have you a reaction have that you've held. <laughs> so. Jesus attack. Christ. We got oh, your reaction. Oh, no, that doesn't make sense here at all. <laughs> Yikes. Okay, uh, so I'm going to... I'm. Well, I already... I did the reaction, so yes. I'm going to go into the sphere of bad things happening, and I'm going to stab this motherfucker. <laughs> okay. Um. Also... Do you did you use your product so I can delete it if you did? I did, yes. You did. Okay, cool. Mm -hmm. Do the thing. Do the thing. Okay. And then if it was a ready action, should I do both of my attacks now? Or yeah, should I go for it? Okay, yeah. Okay, so just the nine. Jesus, my print is crazy. Okay, so that's like a 25 to hit on one of them and a 21 on the other one. They both hit. Excellent. We love to hear it. And then that's... Ah, close. No, go away. 1d6 plus 5. That means you've moved forward to engage with the thing, right? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Which means then at the end of your turn, I believe you take you have to do the strength saving throw? Uh, if they uh, end their turn there. Yeah. Start with... Okay. Uh, Damascus is out of the room. Cool. Go. Uh, so that's 13 total damage 13 from damage, the tridents. Okay. And then what are all the saves I need to, or should I do, should I do my octopus stuff Go before we do doing? savings? Okay. So my octopus, what can he do? Let me open him back up. Okay. He's going to use his little tinties and he's going to try to grab him. Um, so let's see. Oh, but he's also got to come forward into the thing to do so, but that's fine. Of 17 to 17 hit. It does. Oh my gosh, good. Okay, it's, so... It's massive. It's hard not to hit it. It does one bludgeoning damage. Okay. Exciting. It tries. <laughs> you know, um, he <laughs> might kill someone one day. I'm. That's my goal for him. And then the target is grappled. So. Grappled. There you okay. go. I don't really remember what um, that does, but it seems like it would help. cannot helps. grapple it. Oh! Yeah. I'm sorry, octopus. It is immune to being grappled. My little octopus and is going so to take damage more for things. no reason. So many more things. <laughs> well, you know what? I've got my friend here for moral support. That's still helpful. Yeah, he's he's there <laughs> just chilling with you. You feel a deep bond to him, and he's trying to protect you. He loves you. Mm -hmm. uh, I love him too. Let's do your let's do your strength save. Yes. Okay. Damascus, so if you want to regain the points mm -hmm. that you lost because you moved, that's cool. I didn't. You lost nothing. Uh, only okay. I, I passed it. Okay. And what did you get? 13. So you're going to take fail. some damage. <laughs> yeah. Roll it. <laughs> uh, five. Five points. Okay, that's not bad. Okay, okay, okay. Is that your turn? Oh, I should have fucking raged. I forgot yes. to rage. I'll rage next time. <laughs> bonus, did you bonus action anything? Um, I don't know if I have. Let's see. 
Oh, yeah, I can bonus action rage. Okay, good. Bonus action, you're going to rage. Yay. At and the very me... end of your turn, you get mad. Let me do my uh, wild magic table. Where are you? Oh, shit. I always forget about that. Sorry, do, I it, go do it, do it, do it. Find all my things. Wild magic. Where are you, table? The entire area becomes the silent around you for 30 feet. Right. Can you imagine? Wild okay, there we are. Okay. It's a D8. Very small what table, yes. Yeah. Oh, I teleport. Oh, I teleport up to thirty space. feet to an unoccupied space. Okay, Each cool. round, so you could nice. pop out. You don't even have to take that damage. You could pop out and then just yeah, run you back just, in after as as your bonus action. Yeah, okay, but you she um does that count you <laughs> until your rage ends? So next turn, I think you use your bonus action yes. to to get out of there. Okay, all right. Dope. <laughs> okay, uh, let's. Let's move on. Winter. What's what do you do? What do you do? Uh so I'm maintaining concentration on my spell. Uh roll for him first. Let's we'll see if he sees it. Oh. Uh roll for like his wisdom save? Yep. Okay, sorry. Yeah. Um randomly our stream like unmuted, so I got distracted by my own voice. <laughs> totally fine. Um so with advantage, uh, oh, it's the same thing. It's a 22. Yeah, he's fine. He sees it. He's like, I just hate this so much. I need to learn how you do that voice because it's so good. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> um, okay. And so obviously I just hate that so much. And therefore... I I need to you, hit it, kind of. All right. So I'm gonna jump in there, and I'm gonna move in five, ten, fifteen feet, and um, just go charging in with Leader's Warhammer or a four hammer. Smash. Basically, so I I he like grits his feet down and like gets low. And kind of like buffets into the storm, just like on the pure strength of his legs alone. Uh, obviously, winter never skips leg day. No, never. And uh, he's Slops just like for days, like pushing his way through. Uh, and it's gonna take two attacks. Do it, because he's a two attack kind of boy. Uh, hit him hard. Um, that is a fifteen to hit and a twenty-six to hit. Both hit. Sweet. Okay. Uh so then that's two of these plus that. Um 21 points of damage. Okay. And just making sure that this is I'm just reading more on Vito's Warhammer. Okay, no, uh, so that's that's what it does. So um, then he's attacked, and then he's going to attempt to move back to where he started. Uh, okay. This, of course, will provoke an opportunity attack. Yep, 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 by, um, by four of those heads. Oh, bring it. Okay, okay, yeah. okay. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see. Let's see. Maybe it's gonna roll some shit. Let's attack. Let's see here. Uh, ten. No. No. Twenty-one. No. Eleven. No. Twenty-four. Yes. Yes. Okay, he's a cast okay. shield. Ho ha! She throws a shield up in front it of him. Misses. Fine, don't die. Uh, the no, I don't. Is... I don't like you, though. <laughs> yeah, you don't. <laughs> uh, and you are missed, and you get out. Cool. Uh, dead of his turn. Um. Yeah, because yes. it has it hasn't been the false hydra's turn yet. So nope. Perfect. So I've been missed. I don't need to maintain concentration. I just maintain concentration. 
uh, we move on. Faiza. Uh, needs to roll to see the thing. Uh, question for you, DM. Uh, mm-hmm. Is it it's seeing it a charm effect because she has advantage on those? Oh, she has advantage anyways. Because of the song thing. Wow, one in the three. She don't see shit. It vanishes from her sight. Does she remember that she was fighting it? Nope. Okay. What? What? What are we doing? <laughs> Why am I casting that weird spell? What's happening? And this thing is bullshit. She drops it. <laughs> oh yeah, roll to see if she drops it. She doesn't know what she's doing. Uh, we'll just do fifty fifty. Eleven or higher, she keeps it. Okay. That's another. I'm really gonna garbage for her. Uh, she drops that spell because she's like the spell drops. What am I doing? Um, why am I here? I, I think you're all freaking out about nothing. Everybody should just calm the fuck down. And who are she, you people? <laughs> she doesn't remember us. I feel like it is entirely in character for Faza to cast calm emotions on the party to get them to Ooh. chill the fuck out. Okay. Um, second level spell. She's not freaked out though. She just doesn't know what's happening. She's confused. Yeah, but we're all fighting something. Yeah, why is everyone why is everyone freaking yeah. out, guys? So everyone should just be chill. Everybody calm down. Something's fucking with your heads and making you think you're fighting something. There's nothing there. Um it suppresses any effect causing a target to be charmed or frightened. Ben? That's all. I okay. know that it tried to charm Damascus when it uh-huh. got into the back of his head, so at least there's that some lasts protection for a that. minute. She's keeping concentration on that? Yeah, it's concentration. Okay. Okay. Excellent. And she's not going to attack anything, so I figure that's kind of makes sense for her to do. Okay. Is that her turn? Uh, yes, because there's not much else that she would do without knowing that we're fighting something. Okay. It is now the False Hydra's turn. And as a bonus action... Wisdom save! Oh, oh, wisdom oh, save. Wisdom right. save. All right. In sixteen. Bam. What happens? Radiant damage from the butterflies. Excellent. Radiant damage. Um, sixteen points of bursting ice butterflies on the skin, please. Noise. Noise. Okay. Nice. And uh, what happens next? We have a con save. No, nope. it's gone. That's gone. Nope. Okay, so I can delete that con save. Let's do that. It's got four heads. As a bonus action, it regains some hit points. And you see that it starts to look a little bit healthier as a little nub begins to reappear where the head was. It's healing itself. Uh, um, Anybody can stop that. Where head was? We, We destroyed a head? Mm-hmm. You did, you did, you yeah, did. Damascus it has four it left. Oh, has, I missed that part. It has two more turns around to get that head back. Okay? Okay. Um, Keep wailing. Yes. Uh, let's see here, let's see here. Wait, I didn't, I did. Fuck. There we go. I fucked up and added that as damage. All right. It is going to, it can't do that. It's smart. One sec. It's smart. It looks at Faza. And it takes two big steps forward so that it is right in front of her, able to hit her. And it's going to direct all four attacks on Faza. Who oh. knew? As. Well, you know what? Three attacks. One of them is singing. It's fine. It's three. She can't be that bad, right? Okay, let's mm-hmm. do it. It's yeah, fine. fine. So, 15, 16, 17 to hit. Misses. Miss. Whoa, fuck me. Um, that is a 19, 20, 20, 24. Question. Yes. She doesn't know she's fighting something. No. So she can't cast shield on herself. No. Okay, then that hits. she doesn't even see it. Okay, but she Ooh. out of nowhere 
gets his teeth just reach out and grab onto her and shake her just a little bit as it and then pull back and she's like what um i need a con save and i'm going to give her her damage and she takes five piercing damage uh 19 con 19 okay so 19 con is ooh okay you're good you're fine you're fine because uh winter's there i didn't see winter so it's 24 okay um, and then, and then, nope, it can't do that because it's got that thing up. Okay, that's its turn. You only attack with two heads. No, I attacked with three. Okay. Yeah. One of them didn't okay. even, was not even worth adding up. Oh, okay, okay. My bad. Uh, okay, cool. She's fine. Oh, um, it's ending its turn in this uh, sphere. Strength so save. what save is that? Strength. Strength save. It fails. Great. So it takes seven points of bludgeoning. Seven. Enter. Okay. Uh, next is Varian. Roll for me. Okay. You have a bardic as well if you want to add that to your... Oh, I, I probably do. Um... So I have this. I'm gonna I'm gonna use the bardic from chat first, which is a D6, right? Okay, yes. So I'm gonna use that first. So 18. You're good. Sweet. You see it. Varian, right in front of you. Oh for the shit! What the fuck is that? And the one of the heads swivels to you, the one that's singing, and you hear another one as it's not even looking at you. Let out this. <laughs> no, 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 no. You can go back looking the other way. You don't need to pay attention to me. Anyways. <laughs> and like. I'd... Your next hit is a crit if you oh, roll for damage. That is true. So if, if that's the case, then the first thing I'm going to do is as a bonus action. I'm going to uh, pull the radiance from my storm sphere and go, ah, no, and just like slap okay. a rainbow across its face because happy Pride Month. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. From from my storm sphere uh, because I want to roll HD6 of radiant damage instead of uh, four. So uh, please hold while I roll copious amounts of dice. Um. It's beady eyes turn towards you with another head as it like you you for the first time get to see like this this mucus covered white almost larvae like creature with heads no wiggle towards you <laughs> and, and, and as I do I I rip apart the uh the actual light in the air spreading it into the spectrum due to sheer magical force and the eruption of it as this as like a light moat comes down and hovers in front of its face and just literally rips apart the the cannon like force of of this rainbow spectrum coming across his face deals 33 points of radiant damage you fucking all this power just slams into this creature at once and the head that was just looking at you <laughs> falls off as you sever it from its body. Yeah, Adam. Excellent. Yeah, um, ready to go. And then that being said, the next... Oh, no, I can't do that because that's a concentration spell, isn't it? It is. Okay, so I'm not going to do that. Um, so the next thing I'm going to do is just try and cast a Ray of Frost. So uh, I, after this thing goes down, I'm just kind of like, what? Chill out, For a fucker. second, 
it looks it's still looking at you the head from the floor in this teeth like <sighs> I'm just gonna be the fuck and I cast ice uh ray of frost off in the distance at an, a, another head so this one I have to roll for um I oh that's a 27 to hit yes that hits sweet uh so 2d8 hold the damage that's nine points of frost damage. Nine points of damage. All right. That's it. And we circle around to the top of the round. Damascus, give me those saves. Yeah, got my saves. Advantage. Oh, minus D4, right? Fourteen. Am I still with Winter? I am. So that is a nineteen. Nineteen. You're good. No. Yeah, you are. You're good. You're good. You're fine. Go. Okay. Damascus is going to do two things. Uh, uh-huh. First, I'm going to Eldritch Blast it. Okay. I'm a warlock. I put my sword and light shoots out. Comes flying out. Bashes into whichever the next head we're taking. That you're out fucking is. happy for Belloth now, huh? Yeah, I appreciate it. Go down, you stupid fucking five headed. Da. Um, I've got twenty four and twenty five to hit. Both hit. It staggers a little bit. Rolls on its flabby, gross, beady little, wormy body. That is going to be twenty one. No, eleven plus math. It's hard. And that is seven each, so eleven plus fourteen is twenty-five damage. Twenty-five Radiant. damage, very nice, very nice. Okay. And then, um, I have to double check, but I'm pretty sure I can just do this as an object interaction. I'm gonna throw one of my cards in front of it to try and like Ooh. distract and be a alternate source of attack, at least for one attack until it realizes it's a, uh, illusion. Okay. I'm going to throw one of my cards in front of the damn thing. And it's going to be the Seven of Hearts, which is a gelatinous cube. I toss a card and it lands in front of this three now now three-headed creature. And just bloop, a cube of gelatinous mass just flops right in front of it. Completely okay. illusory, but... Um, okay, okay, okay. There is a save... It can make if it wants to see if it's an illusion. Uh, it's a DC 15 investigation check, but it that's only if it it has to use its action to actually do that. All right. And then bonus action, I'm going to hit Phaza with a Bardic. Okay. Uh, so she's got a D10, hopefully to try and see the damn thing. And movement. I don't think it's anywhere near me, but I'll start flailing. My cape, just in case. All right. And Is that your turn? turn? Okay. Uh, Gilly, what you doing? All right. Do your rolls. Do my rolls. Your rolls. Do we still have advantage on the wisdom? You do? Yeah, okay. My, my storm is still storming. 19? It was 15. You're good? Okay. Can still see it. Excellent. Still present in the situation. I mean, I would hope you're like right out. No, you you left. You're not in front of it. Okay, cool, cool. Still able to yeah. Oh, yeah, true. Bonus, bonus, myself. bonus. Yes, I did. And then I guess I'll just teleport back. Well, no, I'll run back in. I'll yeah. run back in. Okay. <laughs> and I'll get my trident and just try and like, I'm going for the neck. I'm going for the neck and then I'm twisting it. See Roll what ahead. I can do here. Okay. Yes, yeah. Get those okay. rage. One bonuses. of them definitely hits. Six plus nine is fifteen. Does fifteen hit? Yep. Okay, so both of them hit. Meets it, beats it. Excellent. And I still have to look up my freaking what's my damage every single time. Okay. Jeez, six plus five. Three. So two eights and then plus three on both of those because I'm raging. So 22 damage on those. Okay. 
22 damage. And then you know what? My octopus is going to try and grapple it again, even though it can't, because it's going to do one damage if it does. So um, as you that's something. do another 60 points of damage to this thing, another head falls yeah. off. You did. You went for the neck, you jabbed in there, and you twisted, and you hear a one of them falls I'm picturing off, it just like stuck on the end. Throat. I'm picturing it stuck on the end of the trident like an olive. You no. just have, have, gotta shake it to get it off. Ugh, ah. <laughs> oh, no. Nasty. Uh, yeah, you Dan's do. 100% you have to shake floor. it to get it off. As um, it sloughs off with the gray matter and the scales and the white putrid flesh. Yep. You're just like, yeah. you're sitting there reminding yourself, this is why you don't have olives on your pizza. <laughs> I'm gonna have to clean <laughs> yeah, this yes. thing after with this is a little bit. Uh, the octopus did hit too, so one additional bludgeoning damage there. Oh, so cute. Like okay. And then I'm gonna teleport right the hell out of there. Um, and I feel like when the wild magic stuff happens, Gilly does not fully know what's going on. So she teleports you just up, end up just like, like somewhere ah, out, like whoa. Uh, okay. <laughs> okay. You okay. You're fine. Uh, <laughs> uh winter. Yeah. What you doing? Seems like hitting is effective. We do that again. Okay. You so run in there. It's more of a step, but I step in there. Step <laughs> in there. Feet, step five feet forward, and I am going to make two attacks. Uh, that is a so close. Um. It's like a 27 and a 19 to hit. Both hit. Okay. So uh, Paladin is going to Paladin. Um, Smite. White. Yeah. <laughs> uh, it's got two heads left, right? Yes. Perfect. Well, on each of these attacks, it'll pump. It'll pump. He'll pump a first level Smite. Okay. Um. Is it a... It, it's a fiend or undead, right? That gets like the bonus d8 from Divine Smite? Yes, it is not. It is neither an undead nor a fiend. It's a monstrosity, for sure. It Balls. is Balls. Aberration. Mm-hmm. Mm. Damn. Much like balls. Um, okay, so that then that's 3d8, because uh, it doesn't make a difference, right? Magical bludgeoning or radiant, I don't need to have anything. No, go ahead. Okay, so that's 68 damage plus 8. So, oh, shoot. I dropped that one, so I rerolled it. So, uh, 8 plus 8 is 16, plus 5 is 21. 27, 34, 38 points of damage. You do 38 points of damage, and it shrieks. And you take some psychic damage. Let's see here. What are you Boring. taking? You take three psychic damage, but it's enough to make you deal a, do a con save. It is. Uh, 18 plus 7, so 25. Yes. Is that your turn? Uh... Just going to invite, not invite those opportunity attacks uh, by staying still this time. Because I'm still 10 feet from literally everybody. So we're good. Okay. Uh, Faiza? Let's roll to see if she knows what the fuck's going on. As as she's kind of rolling, because Winter had just come up and like swung his hammer into apparently invisible space, like as as he's doing so, he like pulls the hammer back, having unleashed this divine frost energy, like carving swaths of ice up into what looks like empty air. He turns around and he just goes, "Come on, Faza, it's right here." Go ahead, roll uh, with advantage. You know, Faza is going to. She did roll with advantage. Plus five plus two is twelve. She's gonna use her bardic. Uh you have a plus five for being five feet from me. 
yeah, no, that's with the plus five. Okay, okay. Oh. Yeah, use your bardic. Use your bardic. I rolled real bad, but I'm gonna use bardic. That's an eight. So that's twenty total. Okay. And as you say that, it's right here. She goes, holy shit. And she sees it. <laughs> the as bardic is Damascus being like, Bezadalin, we could really use your help. Do that thing where you get that that creepy hand to punch things in the face. What do you call that spell? Bitch slap? Lich slap. That's the one. Lich slap! Lich slap! And she is going to do two things. Uh, she is going to um, quicken spell. Two sorcery points. Bam, bam. Uh, she's going to quicken spell Thunderstep to get the fuck out of this thing's way because she does not okay. want to be next to it. Fuck um, yeah. Oh, that's going to hurt people that's oh, fine yeah. winter she'll do it she can take him with her oh she could he's gonna she's gonna grab winter and be like let's let it hit I, I, the thing to mask <laughs> yeah grabs winter and she's gonna just thunder step behind the line oh okay behind damascus basically she'll bring winter i guess behind or uh varian uh <laughs> it's gonna have to make but just she's like what? <laughs> Let's go. She heard him. She was like, okay, you're right. Fuck that thing's scary. Boom. You... Um Constitution saving throw. Fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. It fails. Uh it takes seven, nine, eleven thunder damage. Oh shit. Okay. And that was as a bonus action. And then she's going to use her action action to try and uh, listen to Damascus and uh, lich slap it. Just chill touch. Just All right. You at home who don't know. Lich, chill touch. Not cold. Not touch. Should be called lich slap. Fine. <laughs> and it doesn't does seem to be a... laughing anymore. Oh, good. Does a 17 hit. It does. Okay, that's 2d8 damage. I'm glad it's not laughing. That's 5 damage. And more importantly, it can't regain hit points until the start of phases next turn. Oh, nice. Shit. How much damage was it? 5. 5, alright. Okay, okay, okay. Is that her turn? That is her turn. Actually, uh, it wails, by the way, uh, and she'll take uh, seven psychic damage. She'll take three psychic damage because she takes half damage from psychic. Yeah, but con save. Three damage, con save. Nat 20. You're good. You're good. It starts its turn. So we have to do a wisdom saving throw, right? Loss. At the start of his turn, yes. Yes. Yeah. Thanks so. to Winter. Thanks, Winter. 18. Uh, 18 succeeds, yeah. All right, it's fine. Is it um, the cat damage? I, uh, I believe, yeah, actually, with... I think it does. Spirit Guardians, it's half damage. So, hang on. Spirit Guardians. Yeah, half as much. So I'll roll over nice. 3d8. Good catch, Dane. Yes. Yeah, no problem. Thank you for helping the non-paladin <laughs> play paladin things. Um, rules lawyer than a rules lawyer. <laughs> well, I seem to have misplaced one of my d8s, so I'll just roll one of these at another time. Oh, wow, okay. Um, oh, shit, I've been fucking playing this wrong. <laughs> It can attack twice with each head that's not fucking attacking. That's not singing. Motherfucker. You can oh, just you can keep playing that wrong if you want. <laughs> yeah, twice as many attacks this whole that's time. Fine. Yeah. God damn. We're okay without that, actually. That <laughs> feels fantastic to have not happened. Um so what happens? Uh 14 to uh, set seven points of radiant damage. As a couple of these frosty butterflies just go. Awesome. Okay. 
possum. Is that his turn? That's the start of that's the start of the turn. Oh, that's the oh, fuck. That's my turn. God <laughs> dang. It's your turn. I will remind All you. Right. There's a giant illusory gelatinous cube right in front oh, right yeah. in space. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, it is. Let me just read. See if it can see it or not. Yep. Dark vision, passive, passive perception. No. Okay. Cool. So it is going to attack it once because it's right there. Um, and it's obviously not a thing. Yeah. Uh, then it will move out of this storm or getting out of the storm and right up to, uh, let's see, you're causing it issues. It's going to go right up to um, Varen and it's going to make its second attack. And it's going to get a nat 20. Hey. Um, and it's going to do, let's see here. Oh, let's see here. It's going to do 20 damage to you. Okay. Uh, what? Do um do a con save for me. Yep. Oh. <gasps> I pass with an 11. 11, okay. Okay. Uh, and... But it's scary because I rolled a 4. <laughs> Shit, guy. Oh, oh, and... plus Damascus. Or not to, uh, plus Winter. I would have been fine anyways. Yeah, 16. And it is not going to do any of that other stuff because it cannot... It does not stop singing. It continues to sing. So. Uh... Ooh, no, because you, you're out of the. It's everybody is out of that fucking whirling mass of mm-hmm. noise. And so, so are its heads. And well, so it, are its heads. Mm-hmm. I'm going to say that there's no more disadvantage, no more advantage for those con saves or it, those wisdom it, saves. Even though the spell's description says that it's within thirty feet of the like of the storm, so it says creatures that with. It, Creatures within 30 feet of the sphere have mm-hmm. disadvantage on wisdom perception checks. So it's like the, the, the noise of it. So like the, the sphere is like the 20 foot radius or whatever. But then like 30 feet further than that is so loud that it. All right. Yeah, we'll we'll keep it up then. Uh, and then <laughs> Varian, it is your turn. Okay, and uh, like the the ha- its tail and everything still being in the sphere doesn't count as it being in the sphere at the end of his turn. Uh, it's just because I didn't move it, but we can we can do it that way. I didn't move it; it's cool. Okay. Um, the big honking guy. That's a big thing. I didn't have anything that looked like a hydra, so I just used a real hydra. I mean, that's uh, valid. Um, it it's it, it's only five points of bludgeoning. If that. It's not much. Oh no, it's yeah, it's it's fine. It, Carol, was there something that you had wanted to say? You seemed to kind of like you wanted to say something for a minute there. No, I'm good. Oh, okay. Uh, <laughs> well then, because it's my turn and this thing's in my fucking face, which is terrifying because it's ugly as shit. Um, I suppose the first thing I'd want to do is. Use my bonus action because now I actually have to attack with it, but make a ranged spell attack with my storm sphere, uh, my radiance sphere here, um, and try and hit. So, uh, with disadvantage, it's a ranged spell attack, and it's not really far from it. It's still. Oh, I guess he's yeah, he's five feet in front of me, huh? Yeah. Have anything melee? Well, this is just my bonus action, so uh, I don't have any sort of. It still might hit. It's not like it has high AC. Um. So. 
Thunder Wave. Mm -hmm. Thunder Wave is a 15 foot cube originating from me. So Mm -hmm. if I were to, you know, like have it originating from me in front of me, that means it wouldn't hit any of the people beside me, right? Yes. Oh, sweet. So then my first thing will be that I'll cast Thunder Wave. Um, Okay. And I'm going to cast it at second level because why not? Why not? So uh, I need it to make a constitution saving throw. Okay. Let's do the thing. Uh, 18? And 18 succeeds. Yeah. So half damage? Half damage and you're not pushed away from me. And I was like really hoping that you'd be pushed away from me. Um, But... So that's uh, 3d8 thunder damage. So 16 cut in half is 8 uh, thunder damage. Okay. And then... And it will it will wail, by the way. So I take some five psychic. Yeah. Okay. Uh so and con save. Yeah. Uh not twenty. You're good. (laughs) Yeah. Where where was that earlier? Um, and then you know what? I'm I'm not gonna move. I'm gonna take the disadvantage. I'm just gonna try and uh, use my storm sphere without getting attacked by these things. Are you fucking kidding me? Uh, it, it was a nat eighteen or not one. Oh so, no! <laughs> so yeah, that it doesn't hit. So my my bonus action misses, and that's the end of my turn. Okay. Um. Let's see. Uh. Damascus. Damascus is going to do Damascus things. This thing's right in his face, so he's not going to try to... You're going to make a roll first. Oh, right. Damn. Uh, Still got advantage, right? Minus a d4. Oh. Damascus don't see shit. Uh, Six minus three is three, plus two is five, plus winter is ten. So it it's really weird, but you you're kind of why are you here, Damascus? What are you why is everyone so stressed out? Why are we in a cave? Y'all need to chill out. Everything's fine, relax. Like there ain't nothing to worry about. Um, you make me a con saving throw? I mean, why are you even holding on to a spell? No. <laughs> Mm, I should have used Lucky on that last roll. Okay. Um, five, but I'm going to use Lucky on that. Okay. My last luck point to hold on to the spell for... <laughs> 18 uh, plus 18. four. 18, okay, okay. She's still, so she's still okay. Her daddy still loves her. Her daddy still loves her. So friggin' invest in this. Uh-huh, 100%. <laughs> I have used my con- like I could be so much more effective in this fight. Yeah, you could have. <laughs> don't even care. Worth it. Worth it. Um, I'm going to let me see if there's anything useful I can do that's not. Uh, I'm it's fine, and in fact, you know, you're really calm too. I mean, phases cast calm emotions on you. Nothing is wrong, Damascus. That's Nothing is wrong. True. Um, but I would look around and I see, like, I still remember that they're, like, who everybody is, right? You don't really know why you're here anymore. So I You do know, know these everybody. people, but okay. why are you here? You're, you, why are we, you're not supposed to be in the well. It's poison. All right, everyone, we got to get out of this well. And y'all look pretty hurt, actually. So probably, oh, we must have tumbled in here and gotten banged up. All right. I can take care of that, no problem. I'll I'll use a third level slot to cast uh mass healing word. So everybody <laughs> nice. nice. Uh two plus five, seven hit points. Seven Ooh. hit points. All right, all right, all right. 
All right. Is... Now that we're all a little bit feeling better, we should just get out of this well. We're going to get in shit if we're in here. It's fair enough. It's fair enough. Is that your turn? Um, yeah, I don't think I'm going to fight, so there's nothing else I'm going to do. Okay. Okay. Gilly. Oops. Roll for me. All right. Fingers crossed. Do we, st- we still have advantage? Mm hmm. Okay. That's good. Oh, it's not that good. Oh. Oh, no. Oh. Ten. Oh, no. Gilly doesn't Ten. know what's going on either. Ten. You know what, Gilly? Damascus is making a lot of sense. I mean, he's never led you wrong before. You guys have been friends forever, as far as you're concerned. And it's so nice he just to heal you my up, damage. So, uh, I mean, if you wanted to, you could use your 30 feet of, of bonus action movement that you just blip away to... To start checking out if it's safe to leave. I don't know. My freaking fr- octopus failed to. It's my last ditch one. <laughs> one point of bludgeoning damage. Oh no. Dang it. Yeah, I guess I gotta do my little... What's the? You don't have to use it. You. It's just a... It's like a... You don't have to... I feel so bad. I like say this shit and then I'm like, you don't gotta do that though. <laughs> Let's see. No, you know what? I'll just... I'll blip kind of over behind everybody and be like, hey guys, what are y'all doing here still? It stinks in here. The well's poison. We gotta get out of here. All right, all right. Uh, don't Let's forget go. to re to so place yourself. You did, you did. Okay, cool. I did. Um, fuck. Okay. Uh, <laughs> that's your turn, yes? Uh, I suppose so. <laughs> okay. Uh, Winter? Can you roll mm-hmm. for me? Mm-hmm. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. You guys are going to be fine. You guys are going to be fine. <laughs> you, you're not fine. Oh, God. Are you not fine? 23 is fine, right? Yeah, you're fine. Okay. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> Sorry. I just wanted to mess with you a little bit. Um, uh, Widow's kind of like, this is not going the way it should be going. And so he's going to move up and take his two attacks. How many times are we going to have to pull you out of where? Why? <laughs> what is the point of me being here? Okay, so uh, that is a nat 19 and a nat 16 on the dice. Oh, you hit. Uh I'm getting a little like this thing needs to go down, so I'm going to pump two second level smites into it. All right. So that is 8d8 total. Okay, roll it. Give me the damage. Okay. Uh, 8 plus 6 is 14. Uh... 21, 23, 29. False den, the false hydra is looking pretty hurt. I mean, guys, like it's it's hurt. It's feeling it. 32 plus the 8 of the actual strike is 40. That's 40 points of damage. 40. And that second last head falls off. Oh, which is taking Vedra's Forge Hammer, which is constantly covered in horror for us. And just bludgeoning strike out like it it looked like two strikes, but he's just hammering away. Yeah, he's, he's just, just like bam, wham. Bam. for flavor, but, like, he's just going ham he's going ham on it with his hammer. <laughs> yeah. It's it, it's blunt force trauma, and he's just like, you know, like it rips through scale, it rips through flesh, it like smacks over bone, and eventually squish, he just like, squish, he, squish. He like gets through it, and then like as the Warhammer like finally plants through the neck. He slams the Warhammer on the ground behind the head and just two hand reverse grips and just knocks the head backwards across the chamber. Pulls the hammer back and looks back at the last head and just goes, I'm not done. Oh, it stops singing. Oh, shit. Nice. <laughs> it just got real. Uh, well, it'll stop singing on this turn. Hang on. Um, but, uh, you're in the is it, are you in the you're not in the thing right you don't have to do a con save right no you're good, you're good. Yeah. okay we're fine yeah we're almost out of it oh shit <laughs> uh is that your turn that's his turn 
Okay. Uh, Faiza, some saves. Faiza's got to do some saves. Please don't forget, we need more people to remember. <laughs> uh, 15 Ooh. plus 15 you're minus 2 is 3. Oh, no, you're not. Uh, no, 13. Hang on. 15 minus 2 is 13. Plus 2 is 15 plus winter. Okay, okay. you're fine. You're fine. It's still there. Okay. Uh, oh my god, I hate she it She yells so at Damascus, probably. Damascus, you dumb shit! <laughs> you know it! <laughs> Um, she will. Uh, she's going big. Uh, she's going to do lightning bolt at its stupid head at fourth level. Yeah. Right okay, into do its it. face. Okay. Uh, Hell it's a yes. Save. It's a deck save. Big. Oh, it fails. Dumb. That's what I was it hoping. It fails. I'm just going to roll it on here. It takes 28 lightning damage. 28. Nice. Okay, cool. And then... Uh, you know what? Yeah, she's going to use Quicken Spell to try and Lich Slap it again. Alright. Ooh, it's probably not going to hit. That's a 5 plus 9. Uh, 14. No. It okay. does not hit. It goes wide. This, like, creepy... Gross looking lich hand comes flying out of her fist and the head wobbles away from it. Uh and it is now our false hydra's turn. So wisdom saving throw first, yes? I was muted, but I said it. <laughs> wisdom saving throw. Uh that's a 19. Damn that. No. Okay, half damage. Half damage. Winter coming in with another four points of radiant damage. All as right. more blue butterflies just... As it stops singing, it begins to start looking a little bit more healthy as one of those little... That little nub that was growing its... Regrowing its head starts to get eyes. Didn't yes. it get lich slapped? Nope, it missed. It missed. Oh... And it starts to look a little bit healthier. The mouth is beginning to form. And it... Mm. Let's see. Who's it going to go for? Who's it going to go for? Uh, Damascus doesn't know it exists. But you guys can all roll without the minus now. Uh, so that's fine. Uh, be Who's gonna go for? Who's gonna go for? It's gonna go for. It's gonna. It's gonna go for. Winter. Who just hurt the shit out of it? Seventeen. So that is a. How much is that? That is seventeen plus five. What is that again? That is twenty-two. Which hits. hits. Which hits. Okay, he's going to take five piercing damage. And <laughs> can't do anything until that spell falls. So that is its turn. Oh, wait, it is going to move out of this thing. It's learned its lesson. It's a smart fighter. It's going to roll its body and just move out of it so that it's right beside you, but not in it. Ah, uh, that is Varian's turn. Can you roll me? A, it's a DC 15, no minus four. It's not singing. This is just its normal effect. Okay. Right. So there's no there's no uh, advantage on this one. Oh, okay. Uh, nat 17. You're good. No, you're not good. 19. Well, it, it was a oh, no, 15. Con save. It's not a spell. For fuck's sakes, Jessica, pay attention to what you're doing. You're good. It, it's a it's a con save. Yeah, it's a con. You're fine. You're fine. Oh, I, uh, yeah. I, I, I had a I had a twenty four. Then I I thought, I thought it was another wisdom. No, save. no, it's a wisdom saving throw. I, I, it's not a it's not a spell save. Me bad. I'm fucking all over the place. <laughs> okay. Um, Do the thing. 
I, I will attempt to do the thing. I have learned my lesson, and I'm going to bite my bullet and try and move. Okay. So, so I am going to try and move away from it. Okay. Uh, it'll attack you with a reaction. Mm-hmm. Uh, it's going to get a 15 to hit. Uh, oh, it hits. I have an 11 AC. Yep. Oh, okay. No. Uh, Una Memento, will it roll, will I roll the damage? Hoi! Uh, eight damage. Eight, okay. Uh, con save. Armor. Oh, yeah. I rolled a 20. 30, 20. Okay. Pause is here to help. Okay, so now that I've moved... I am going to do, uh, I'm going to repeat, kind of, my action from last turn. Uh, n- no, I'm not going to cast Thunder Wave. I am going to. Oh, I was thinking about this and it still wasn't enough time, was it? Um, you know what? Fuck it. Faisa, I think you were right in the first place. Hope you don't mind. And Varian's going to, like, rub his palms on his hands and kind of, like, get some friction from Arev's hair. And then as he pulls his hands forwards, lightning starts to trail around his fingers until he takes this, like, blue lightning that he normally summons when he uses it. And he plays with it a little. But he looks up at the thing that he can still see and he's like, fuck, I hope this fries you this time. And he, like, rips the lightning around, causing arcs to split off of his arms. And as he pulls a lightning bolt up into the air, he simply pulls a palm back and, like, punches the lightning bolt out of the air straight in the direction of the Hydra. I can't. You're muted. Still mute. Fuck me. I need Damascus to give me a dex saving throw as it is going right through you as well. It's space, yes. Uh, I don't. I don't have the careful spell meta magic. Meta, 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 meta magic. I'm sorry. It's fine. I rolled a twenty six with winter's stuff. So uh, seventeen. Okay. Uh, it got a seventeen. Yeah. That's meets beats it, so it takes half damage. All right. That's frustrating. Absorb elements. Um, silvery barb. No, I don't see it. Never mind. You don't see it. Why are you casting lightning at me? The hell, very. I know it's shocking, isn't it? Isn't it? So you're going to take I'm half of that, though. Shocked and appalled. Yeah, I still take half. So does it? Okay. All right. So that's eighty six. Yeah. Uh, that is. Masquerian just attacked you. Sixteen. For no reason. Yeah, if I don't see it next turn, he might uh, do something. That row. So that's 30 points of lightning damage cut in half. So both of them take 15. Okay. That would have been so good. Uh, And then bonus action, I rip another rainbow out of my storm and smack it at the uh, false hydra. Alright. With disadvantage? No, I I moved away. It's from your storm, emanating from your storm, is it not? Yeah. So then it's right beside it. It says I have advantage on the attack roll if the target is in the sphere. Uh-huh. But I can I can reach sixty feet out from the center. Yes, but it's a ranged spell attack. But only if he's only if it's only if I'm within. within five feet of him. Okay. Okay. Sure. Uh, by the way, you do take seven psychic damage when it screams at you, though. Oh yeah, not a problem. Yeah, yeah, and then add the uh, eleven on my con save. I got so nervous there. Ooh, she almost, you almost Uh had a very sad little girl. So, okay, so. uh, Never mind. Uh, With the 
uh, psychic damage that I took after that uh, lightning bolt, I lose concentration in my storm and can't bonus action, radiant, nothing. You can, I'll let you do that first before you lose the concentration. Oh, okay. Uh, I'm not a cunt! (laughs) (laughs) Um, Tough but fair. Are you sure about that? How sure are you about that? Why? What happened? Because I rolled the nat 20. 20. I can do it. Go for it. (laughs) Do it! Because, yeah... I like. I don't want to move. I want to like take Do the camera it. and pan it down so that you see it. <laughs> I trust you. Uh, that would okay. be the wildest thing to lie about. <laughs> well, because I was like, I, I was like, all right, it, the storm's over, and then she's like, "Do it again." And then I was like, "But it's a crit- Do it again. Are you sh-? Do it again." Okay. All right. All right. Let's, let's go. Um. Jesus. Okay. Uh. Six. 12, 17, 20, 23, 21, plus two. Uh, it was, I said 21 before, and then this is another 12. So that's 33, and we double the damage of the dice, or we double the dice? We double the dice. Okay, so 33. Here we go again. Oh, no, 33 total, because, yeah, it's... 33 total. It okay. was 46 times 2. Yes. So, oof. It screams in pain, but no, da- no, you don't. You've already taken your damage for that. So, as your spell drops, uh, Damascus, Varian's just attacked you. Can you just do that? Can you please? Uh, what in the hell, Varian? Do your, do your, do your throw. Don't minus a d4. Don't, don't do advantage though. Okay. Well, uh, 12 plus winter is 17. You see it again. What? Oh, right. That. You don't, you don't remember it. <laughs> you don't remember it. Every time you forget, every time you lose it, it's like a new creature is back in front of you. Gotcha. What? So horrifying. You were trying to hit that thing, right? Not me. I was trying to hit that thing, I swear. Uh, fair enough. I don't blame you. Fucking hell, that thing is disgusting. Um, Damascus is gonna. That stumpy little head sways. <laughs> but, the last one. Um, no, it's it's got it's it's got one head, and then it's still it's almost regrown one. Yeah, like one and a half. Yeah, yeah. one and a half head. Okay. Uh, I'm going to remember to do this this time because I keep fucking forgetting. I'm going to use Hexblade's Curse on it. Okay. Uh, which lets me add That is concentration? Plus... No. It's not okay. a spell. It's the right. uh, Hexblade thing. Once per short rest, as a bonus action, I can curse it for a minute. I gain plus four damage to bon- bonus to damage rolls, and I crit on a 19 or 20. Oh, and I gain seven nice. hit points that dies. Ooh. So, and bonus. then um, i do the thing. <laughs> Do the thing. I curse it and I go, you're going down. I'm taking that tiny little head off from baking meat. But just being gross and ugly. <laughs> <laughs> <Land of> this. <laughs> I get a 17 and a oh fuck. That's a 19. That's okay. a crit. It's a crit. Do it. Do it up. That's crit. So that is one, two, three, ten, plus eleven, twenty-two. Three D ten plus twenty-two. Oh my god, I rolled so good. Uh, ten, seven, seven is twenty-four plus twenty-two is forty-six damage. Its head whips around as you hit it with your eldritch blast. The light shoots out of my sword as it laughs at me and just right in its mouth. As it la- as it was laughing, yeah. You- <laughs> as it begins to choke on it, and then you hear a growl deep. Ain't in its funny body. this time, is it? <laughs> okay. Oh, as it justice. turns to look back at you. Um. Oh, I'm, I'm closest to it. <laughs> I stay where I am. I'll <laughs> right. do the thing. Uh, I use my movement to flail my coat. Gilly. What okay. you doing? 
I'm rolling my thing again. Ooh, I'm rolling my wisdom. Okay, wait. Uh, and it's not minus the not D4 a D4. Anymore. It has not started singing again. Okay, excellent. It's just straight. So I get an eighteen. Eighteen. You see it. Suddenly, Yay. you look as you were running away. You're like, "What the f- is that? Ah! That's the worst thing I've ever seen." It's Since little. It's like little like doo doo doll head is like waggling yeah. around. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, um, so, okay, so I forgot that my trident can do a special thing. I'm going to do the special thing with my trident. Dun, okay. Dun, dun. Um, I gotta read it again. Okay, so, melee attack, <laughs> jogging back over to the horrifying monster. Bum, 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 bum. Let's see, son down of a you. bitch. Natural one. <laughs> that smile just really it <laughs> hits you right in your soul and you're like that should not be it. happy to see me right now mm-hmm. no ah, unsettling ah, I'm ah. gonna try again <laughs> much better okay I mean plus 23 you hit excellent okay so we're gonna do the normal damage which is 26 plus 5 so eight and then plus three for raging is eleven, and then an extra two d six bludgeoning damage from the special thing, which is a one. Okay, <laughs> I rolled two ones for my extra two d sixes. Excellent. It's okay. So it's okay. <laughs> that's what thirteen. Okay, so it's thirteen damage, and then it has to make a strength saving throw. You see a fifteen. All right. Oh shit, there goes my dice. It's fine. It's fine. Look, I got it. Okay, let's do this again. I just got really excited and I threw it. It failed. <laughs> it failed. Oh, it failed? Okay, cool. It's pushed back 10 feet and knocked prone. Oh my god, it can't be knocked prone. But but it can be go back 10 feet. So five times. I was really it's hoping I'd be able to use this when the storm was still up. There we go. It's at the wall there. Okay. It can't, can't go any further, so it's five feet away from you. Get wrecked. Okay, Get so wrecked. that was my that was my special. Oh wait, hey, I'll do my octopus again <laughs> for the heck of it. No, you best. Never mind. It snaps at it. Um, who's next? Let's see. Winter, what's up? Was good. <clears throat> it needs to die. <laughs> so we we really need to kill this thing. Can you roll for me? Kill it. Yeah, uh, I move forward and I roll. Oh, uh, no, it takes its turn after winter. Okay. So I move forward and I roll a nat 1 to 15. Uh, you don't have, there's no advantage on that. No, it's for its two attacks. No, you had, you didn't roll for his wisdom. Oh, uh, well, the, the to remember f- it first. Yeah, the you have first... to remember that it's there first. Okay. So do you want me to re roll because I rolled two dice? Re roll. Re roll. Okay. Let's use a wisdom bonus. Uh, Winter doesn't have any uh any bonuses, so yeah, he he's got shit all. What do you get? I rolled a nat two plus eleven. That's a thirteen. There's nothing there, Winter. Why is everyone freaking out? You're Dang it. this is there's nothing there. So then he never moved, which means he's still over here. Uh, are you all okay? <laughs> like, what's going on? This is no. Weird. Damn it, Winter, get your shit together. I mean, you're concentrating sh- on a spell, so s- did something happen? I-, I don't know. No, I I dropped concentration because obviously nothing's going on. You don't see anything that's attacking anybody. Oh my god, all of these spells that mean you- that mean you have to see shit. <laughs> oh shit. Um, I have been not been playing this to its best. No, to its I haven't. Best. We haven't cast oh. anything that you can, um, stuff you can see. Yeah, it's uh, the spirit guardians. It doesn't matter whether you can see them. It's just uh, like is is um. I think I think you have to be able to see uh for calm emotions. 
Uh, yeah, but she cast it on us, not on it. But okay. Anyways, uh, <laughs> so what's happening? He he's doing nothing. He's just gonna okay. sit back. He thinks it's a weird that we haven't moved on from this chamber. Why haven't you? You're you should. Oh, winter! You shouldn't even be down here. It's poison down here. No poison for me. I can't get poisoned. No, but your friends can. I mean, yeah, but they never listen to me, anyways. <laughs> oh man, that's so sad. Oh shit. So sad. Okay. But true. <laughs> that's not okay. So, uh, Faza. Right. Let's roll. Roll for regular Faza. for me. Fuck, guys! It's so like. You got it's... some hit points to go, but you're doing such a good job. We we, we were until we started failing our wisdom saves. Yeah. Uh 16. Does she still have Winter's bonus? She's an ally. Okay. Then But she's uh, fine anyway. Tw- okay. 21. Uh okay. Then phase is going to What's it? You gotta have something big. Come on. Um We'll try this again. She's going to do a fifth level. What the hell is it? Um, I guess not. Uh, she'll do it at fourth level. She's going to try thickening radiance again. Okay. What happens? Uh, she will summon up a beam of green energy, this green like cloud fog all around its head. Um, and it just sits there until its turn. Um, Which is next. And then she's going to, hang on, one. She's going to careful spell it, confirm, and then she is going to quicken spell, running low on sorcery points, another lich slap to try and stop its head from regrowing. That'll hit. Uh, that is 24. It hits. And it does whoops, seven necrotic damage. Okay. Okay. Seven necrotic damage. All right. It's just it's skeletal turn. fist punches right in the stupid little nubby head. But she <laughs> it goes flying <laughs> backwards. There's like a little bobble head there for a second. <laughs> <laughs> um, it is its turn. So do we still have to do the wisdom saving throw? Yes? No. You dropped it? I thought you didn't. I, no, he, he dropped it because he, he it has no idea. Sight? Uh, he doesn't know he's fighting anything. He doesn't, he oh, doesn't know he's fighting that's anything. Fair. Okay. Okay. Uh, so the wisdom saving throw is gone. Uh, do I have to do anything at the start of the turn for sickening um, radiance? It is. Thank you for reminding me. At the. First time it starts a turn, yeah. Um, it has to make a constitution saving throw or take 4d10 radiant damage. It fails. Whoa. One, two, three, four. It takes, ooh, good roll. Nine, 14 is 23, plus five is 28 radiant damage. Ooh. Okay. And one level of exhaustion. You notice... Ooh. As where it should be starting to feel tired and lethargic. It just looks angry. But, uh, and this is why I did this the first time, it emits a g- dim greenish light in a five foot radius. So Ooh. it is glowing. Okay. So we can, I'm, I'm hoping that even if we can't see the actual thing, maybe we can see its outline. I don't know. Um... How that helps. I'm going to say no, because it's some, it just, it's not something that like you're visually seeing because it's still in front of you. It just takes it all away. Okay. Right. That's fair. But you guys are, you're getting close. Uh, so it's, it's turn, right? Uh, let's see. Bonus action. It can't heal. Um, it's going to, uh, it's going to make an attack at who's in front of it here. Let's see. Yilly, or if it moves a little bit, it can get to Mascus. It moves right up here. 
and it takes a bite at winter. Who doesn't know it exists right now? Oh, no. For a 22. That hits. That seems like a really uh, miserable it's, experience. It's eight piercing damage as just something saying, like, just... Like, yeah? how, t- how terrifying is it like that a wound would appear on your body, but like theoretically, you might not even be aware that you were just hurt. Yeah, you can't even understand like that something has attacked you. Mm-hmm. You're so like, like you oh. have like a like a like a grievous like gash, and you're just kind of like sitting there like, huh. un like you're like what unfazed. the fuck is happening? Unpleasant. No, no, like like unfazed. You're just like someone's like, doesn't that hurt? You're like, yeah, it's been hurting for months. Like it just has never closed. Like. You don't even, you're not even aware you're being attacked. It's like, you're not left with a sudden gash. Your brain is being overwritten to think that you've always had this wound. It's not terrifying. It's terrifying meta contextually because the other people see this happening to you. You're just like, oh yeah, this, this, I've I've always had this. You don't even know you're fucking being hurt. Yeah, this is just my gash. Yeah, it's pretty fucking awesome. And and while we're on that, um... Can Faza make me a wisdom saving throw uh, of 19? Oh, sorry. Uh, Spellcasting. Yeah, it's a wisdom. Yeah, a wisdom. Uh, She fails. Faza's head kind of shakes a bit. She's like, what is... And then she looks at it and they look into each other's eyes for a second. And she turns on you guys. And I'm going oh, to no. need you to uh Okay, I'm gonna need you to um cast a motherfucking spell on on someone. On somebody in the group? Yep. As she has been completely dominated she by this monster. Help. Okay. Um so she's gonna go big. She's going to cast. Why are you hurting him? He hasn't done anything wrong. I guess the smartest thing for her to do would be drop the sickening radiance on him Uh and cast it on us with her and him as the only ones who uh, are. Yeah. Okay. That's what she does. And she uses her last two sorcery points to do it. Her last, yeah, last two. Okay, okay. Wow, fuck, God damn it, guys. Okay, cool. And um, she'll, um, yeah. Wait, yes. I need to check a rev's inventory for something. But like, my she's Did a counterspeller too. Uh, some. My laptop, like, nearly, like... And she's gonna there. move away from you guys and stand beside it over here. Hello? Hello? Froze. And maybe... Uh, switch uh, did, did, I freeze, did I freeze real bad? Yeah. You froze for a second. So what, what are you doing? Um, I was just trying to check a Rev's inventory because I think he has a earring of counterspell. Ooh. Fair enough. With like two charges left, and if she starts casting a spell on the party, I think Varian might take advantage of that. But yes, I need. My computer is not liking me at all right now. It would be in a Rev's inventory. I can check for you. Please. Like I, the 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 stream stopped playing on Twitch and like I can't see the roll twenty map anymore. Weird. Uh, counter spell earring two charges left. Yeah, three charges on counter spell one used. Okay, so that is a fourth level spell that she casts. You can it you is. have to roll. Yeah, that's fine. fine. I rolled a twenty four. Oh, you're good. The spell drops. 24. Damn. I rolled a 19. I, I rolled a 15. Uh, sorry, 20 then. 
I, th- I thought it was plus nine. It, not you're plus still five. you're still good. Spell drop. Spell doesn't happen. Ah, uh, fuck. She has to, doesn't she? Yeah, she does. She, she does. Can- <laughs> she, she would she have to counterspell that. your counterspell, and it just Freaking. drops. She would have to, wouldn't she? Mm-hmm. E- even though it's the same turn, and she's casting two level spells. Yep. It's a reaction. Yeah, reaction. That's so rude. The leveled spell thing only applies to bonus actions. You can't cast a leveled bonus action spell and a leveled thing spell. You can cast a counter spell. Oh, well, damn. Yeah. <laughs> okay. That was a good thought. So. Yeah, no, it was. I, I tried. Sorry. I feel really bad, but it's what she would. Uh, it's Very what my character it's your turn. would do. It, it's Varian's turn? Yes. At the start of your turn, please make a constitution saving throw. <laughs> I'm sorry. I feel so bad. I'm gonna. I'm gonna roll again for something. Okay, we're gonna see. Ooh, fuck that one. Never mind. I got a twenty-six. Uh, that passes, and the spell does not do half damage. Uh, yeah, and nice. didn't do your wisdom saving throw for just being there. But no minus two d four. It's not saving. Oh, you don't see it? No! Oh, good God. This is not oh. going great for us. But Winter's because... there! Is that with Winter? With Winter, I got a 12. Okay. Mm. Because there are too many saves they need to be making right now, and some of them are going to fail, and some of them aren't. Uh... Okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. You guys are doing really well. I don't feel like it. You are! <laughs> it had 650 hit points. Damn! I wasn't fucking around when I said you might die today. Yeah, well, we still might, because Varian's turn is over. Ooh, we got okay. plenty of time to die. Okay, okay. okay. we got this. Damascus. Uh, big guns. Uh, roll. I'm Two rolls. I'm save first. 16 plus winter. I'm good. I Wait, hang on. Yes. No, it's no not way. over. Um, Faiza is hurting you, and you don't know why. You know she's a friend, but you don't know why she's hurting you. You're not going to move? Are you just going to, like... As Varian, he, would he know enough to try and break concentration? Or dispel magic? Or dispel magic. She doesn't have a reaction left. She can't counter spells. Uh, well, I can't. Can I dispel sickening radiance? It's that a spell. Seem... Yeah, of course. We can. You're using your entire turn effect. to dispel. To dispel it. It's fourth level, so you'd have to roll just like the other one. But yeah, why not? Um, magical effect that you can see within range. Oh yeah. And your DM's I, like, no, no, hang on. <laughs> You're not playing I'm your character you. right. <laughs> I'm trying to help you. No, I, I sorry. You, no, you're right. Like, I think actually what he would really do is cast greater invisibility on himself. Okay. Okay. Because at this point, he'd be like, I told all of you this as well as fucking poison. I don't know what's going on, but people are getting hurt all around me. Anyways, fuck this shit. And he would just literally cast greater invisibility on himself and then he would move. Okay, um, so that would be a that would be an attack with disadvantage then. Uh, like if no, it you're could far enough me. away. Go, yeah, get yes. away. Go, walk away. Uh, I'm attempting to control my token, but my where do you lap... want it to go? Um, I'm trying to reload back things. Do you want it to go back? Uh, like ten, fifteen? How how far away do you want him to go? Uh, about 10 feet down the hall, yeah. Okay, so there you go. He's 10 feet down the hall. All Perfect. right, Damascus, make your rolls. Can, can I keep my con save from before? Yes, what okay. do you got? And I passed I passed my con save. It was a 21 with Winter's thing. Is that um, half? Hmm? Is it half damage or no. just no damage? Right, Sickening okay. Radiance is no damage. Um, and oh, shit. My other one. Ah, oh, Varian, you also have a level of exhaustion. Ooh. He didn't take the damage. He passed it. 
Did he? He passed the safe. Yes. Okay, the cool. Radiance, okay. Yeah. <laughs> um, I got a 15 with Winter's bonus for okay, the wisdom. Okay, you still see it. Yep. Okay, beauty. Um, then I will... The mask... Uh, hey, so what the hell are you doing? Get away from the damn thing. Stop hurting it! It... it no! Look at it! Um, <laughs> What's wrong? All I see is this cute little fluffy creature! It what uh, it looks like. Uh, uh, I don't like that. To be fair, I it will. sounds like she's having a much more pleasant experience right now than we are. Yeah, yep. it does. Uh, it's right in my face, but I don't... I don't... Ultra Blast does the most damage. I'm going to try and blast right into its freaking... I'm just going to put the sword right up against its the base of its neck and try and cast Eldritch Blast through it. Okay. Disadvantage? Um, it's a 15 for the first one. It hits. Oh, okay. And I've told a... you multiple times. Its AC is 15, guys. I have not paid attention multiple times. 25 for the second one. Okay, both hit. And... 8 plus 22 is 30. Okay, you do 30 damage. You take 2 psychic damage. But you do okay. 30 damage. Okay. As it is back. repelled backwards, I believe. Uh phase is right behind it, so it would smash into her, so he's not gonna do um Yeah, he'll have it, he'll repel it backwards. Alright, uh, it is back into this wall here. I'm okay. gonna give Spaza a deck saving throw not to get taken out by it. Okay. Uh it's it's like uh twelve. Got a ten. <laughs> unless winter is unless winter is still considered yeah. an ally no oh, he's not within range he's not uh give give her um give her a d8 of bludgeoning as this massive creature goes flying over top of her <laughs> she got an eight okay cool. she took eight damage and she does a con save okay i'm still holding on to suggestion by the way i passed oh, no, I, I okay yeah oh she rolled a two so plus eight to ten I think 10 passes. Yeah, it does. Okay. She passes. She literally needs a nat one to fail this. Is that your turn? Um, Bonus action. I will... Um, I've only got one bardic left. Fuck. Uh, bonus action, I'm going to bardic... I'm going to bardic winter. And just be like, winter... Will you hit the goddamn thing as hard as you can and just take it the fuck out? Yeah. Wait, no, Winter doesn't see it. What are you talking about? <laughs> what thing? Yep, yep. God damn it. Look! <laughs> and that's how I give it. Okay. That's literally Bardic Inspiration is me telling him, look! <laughs> Gilly. That's my turn. I All right. Let's see if I can see it. Uh, con save and a wisdom save. Okay. Oop, con save is... Plus... Oop, 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 oop. 21. Wisdom save is... Oh. 14. Nah. You don't see it! <laughs> Wait, I, <laughs> I hate this! Why is everyone fighting? What is happening right now? I don't even know you people! <laughs> I don't even know you people! Wait, the poison well. Why is Faisal attacking us? Is that 14 with Winter's thing? Oh, what's Winter's thing? Plus, Plus five, five if you're within ten feet. Yeah. I, I am. Are. Okay. Yeah. You, yeah. <laughs> Guys, it's okay. bloody. Come on. You got to see the freaking thing. Okay. And it's I only my a couple. It's, a, it's only some points left. Some yeah. points. I'm gonna do. Can I do reckless attack when I'm not raging? Because I'm not raging anymore. Because I didn't attack anything. Yes, you I can. can. Okay. I'm gonna do reckless attack on it, again. so I have advantage. You can also, you can also rage again. Can't. Okay. You yeah, have yeah. Three, I think, yeah. at this level. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna rage first. Um, let's roll on that. So you roll run up wild to it. Magic table again. What now? You run up to it. I do, yes, but I'm gonna wild surge first, just in case I've got a helpful. Where's my D8? Where have you gone? There we go. Five. Okay, whenever a creature hits me with an attack roll before my rage ends, the creature takes one D force damage. Nice. Retribution. 
cool. Nice. Um, okay. Got some thorns today. Excellent. So we're going to make our first attack with advantage. That oh, definitely on. hits. Okay. <laughs> um, then I got to look up what all it does again. So it's just 3d6 instead of... So we got a 6 plus 4 plus 3, 13 plus 5 for two of them. Wait, okay. No, no, no. Plus Plus 5 for one of them. 13 plus 5. So 18. And then plus 3 because I'm raging. Okay. 21. Uh Uh-huh. And... Do we want to push it? It can't really be pushed, so we can ignore that part of it. Okay, and then I'm going to just attack again once normal. So that's 21 damage, yes? Yes, 21, 21 okay. for the first attack. Okay. Second attack hits. That's regular d6. Five plus... So the second attack is 13 damage. 13, all right. And amen for the nubby head. All right, all right. You... <laughs> All right. I hate the you, you try head. and hit the nubby head. Oh my god. Um. Okay. <laughs> great. <laughs> it, you hear a <laughs> as it gets hit. Uh, winter. Con yeah. and and uh, and wisdom. Let's do it. Oh, both are fine. Uh, Woo! Yes. Uh, so Winter rolled a con of 23 and a wisdom of 28. Jesus fucking Christ, right in front of you is the most hideous creature that you have ever <laughs> seen! Oh For no, the first you di- time. Oh no, you die now. Uh, <laughs> he moves forward beside Gilly and he goes... Watch your head. And he like swings the hammer like above their frame. Um making two attacks. That is a twenty-six to hit Hits. and an and an eighteen to hit. Hits. Um he's running low on magic and there might be more coming, folks. So I think he's just gonna hit normal like this. Just, you know, in case there's more to be said. So uh, that's some damage. Now, hang on. God, this is not the boss. We're so fucked. <laughs> Seriously? 600 and something hit points? What do you think? I think oh, it's just definitely. wearing us down for the actual boss fight after this. <laughs> so that's 13 points of damage. All right. It takes 13 hit points. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, shit, shit. Okay. That one is 13. Is that your turn? Um, just making sure that I don't have any cool bonus actions. Um, perhaps. Hang on, what's this? Um, actually, here's a cool thing. So, we haven't done this in a, in, in a long time, but... After taking Vera's force hammer and sort of like smoking it into like the side of the the neck, he kind of go bang, ricocheting the head of this hydra one way and then bang back the other. Uh, he takes the hammer and he presses it against the ground, and then he kneels and spreads his palm out flat as frost emanates out uh, past his hand under the form of the hydra. Because as a bonus action, he uses Vera's black ice. Uh, so I he conjures an invisible sheet of ice under the foot of a creature I can see within 60 feet. Uh, but in this case, it's just emanating straight out from him. The target must make a dexterity saving throw against my spell save DC. So dexterity 14. against... They fail. Uh, 2d6 cold damage and be knocked prone until the start of their next turn. So it can't... Wait, it can't be prone because it's immune to it. But it oh, okay. can... It can get the damage. Okay, cool. So, 2d6. 8. I'll roll a 6 and a 2. Beautiful. Okay. Looking good, looking good. Uh, Is that your turn? That's his turn. Oh, I forgot to let my octopus attack. 
missing out on that one point. That would have been what took it down. <laughs> yeah, makes the difference. Sure. Uh, Guys, I'm just letting you know, it... uh, we're keeping it alive until the octopus can kill it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad we know like that now. Take the octopus and throw it at it. <laughs> uh, like a supple. Can, can, what, it, what can phase She's under do? control of of the uh, the false hydra, and she is going to protect it in any way she can. Does she get a saving throw to not have that happen? Let me see. I will go and check. Uh, only if she takes damage. Okay. Oh, that's charming. Okay. Then it's it's the spell dominate person. Cool, cool, cool. Um, okay, uh, Thaza will... I know, I told you that. Um, it's a charm effect. I probably should have gotten advantage to stop it. But that's okay. I She is going to uh, make our lives difficult. She's concentrating on this. She is going to cast... Oh, fuck. No, she's concentrating. Mm. Yeah, she's going to just... Um, nope, that's concentration two. Uh, lightning, bolt. damn it. Yep, she is gonna lightning bolt. Who can she hit from? It's just a straight line. She is gonna hit Damascus go and uh, Winter with a lightning bolt, just third level. That will hit a uh, Rev as well. Mm-hmm. No, Damascus. Oh, no, it's, I, yeah, that, Damascus I thought you were Gilly. Is... You're good. Yeah. yeah. Uh, okay. Winter and Damascus need to make a deck save. She lights up and unleashes just a fuck ton of lightning in your direction. And what happens? Uh, I fail. I've got a two plus seven two. is nine okay. plus five you is... You take full damage. What happens with Winter? James. You're mute. Is it, uh, yes, it was a dexterity saving throw for Winter? Yes. Correct. That is a 14, so he fails. Okay. You both take full damage. What is she rolling there? 8d6 works out to mm-hmm. 27 damage each. You both take 27 Ow. damage. Oh, fucking Christ. Ow, and, geez. um... Ow, basically knock it the fuck off. Winter got Stop knocked down. hurting it! Winter is down. No, 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 no. Winter got knocked down for, like, nearly max health. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> He's fine. <laughs> He's fine. Okay. Are we? He, he he does look at Faisal though. He's confused. He's kind of like, so like, a- am I your brother? Am I not your brother? This How is many getting. How times do I have to tell getting... you you're not my brother? I'm just getting mixed signals. That's all I'm saying. Faisal yes, took dam- Faisal took damage um, when Damascus pushed the thing back. But she never got to make a save for the dominate person. Can I do it at the end of her turn? Yes. And she gets advantage because it's charm effect. Uh, wisdom save. Yeah. Uh, that is nineteen. T- Sixteen plus eight is eighteen plus Winter's thing. Is it's not. She does not get Winter's bonus right now. Not an she's ally. not an ally. Winter still considers her. She an ally. is okay, not that's an fair. ally. Okay, that's fair. Then it's eighteen flat. She needs a seventeen or higher to knock out of this. Damn. Okay. Yeah, its spell save is is nineteen. Fair enough. Uh okay. So is that the whole turn? Yes. yes. Yeah. Okay. Fuck. Okay, so it gets it's gonna re it's gonna heal twenty points. Um I just gave I just damaged it. Let me heal it up. There we go. It heals twenty points and it regrows another head. So it has two heads now. No. Damn the nubby head. But it cannot start singing until the next turn now. 
So you're not at disadvantage or you're not minusing stuff. Okay. Uh, who's in front of it? Gilly, you're going to take two attacks. Great. Let's see as it rears back and you hear, ha, ha, ha. And it, 24, fuck you. And mm-hmm. a 25. Now we roll well? Cool. Yeah, that hits. <laughs> so four damage and four damage. Eight damage total. Okay. It's barely anything. Easy peasy. It's, it's barely no big anything. deal. Um, I'm not even at half. And that's, 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 that's the turn. So, so, or, uh, Varian. Yes, that's me. Yes, do something. Save them. <laughs> so you're getting even, that from your chest. Varian, get your shit together right now. It, even though I'm invisible, I still need to make a wisdom save, correct? Yes, if you can see it. Eh, yeah, if you can see it, and then if you could hear it, but it's not singing right now, so. I, I mean, if I was running down the hall away from it, like if, if okay. I turned around, if I turned around to face it again, I would then have to make the save, right? Okay, so you're if you want to do that, you're running away and you don't know why. Suddenly, you're just running away into the into the darkness. Yeah, because last turn you forgot about it, so you wouldn't mm-hmm. remember. You forget it, about right? it every time you don't see it. Oh. Anytime it affects you, you forget about it. Well, then I guess, like, if I've been, if I spent some time, like, running away, I might kind of, like, wonder what's going on and, like, wonder why people aren't following me and turn around to look. I hear some noises of us doing stuff. Like, I hear hear noises of combat. Do you want to do a perception check? Like, you hear? <laughs> I mean, if I hear that, then like I'm definitely gonna just like turn around and be like, "What the fuck is behind that me?" Nothing's evil. Right? I'm, I'm giving you a chance here. Do you want to do a perception check before you turn around? <laughs> no, I'm just gonna turn around and make turn the turn around. Make your rolls. Oh, uh, okay. So I rolled a 13, which means that I have a 15, which is exactly what I need to pass, right? As you, yeah, as you turn around, you see this, uh, just, oh, I I totally forgot what I'm talking about right now. You see this very, like, slimy, white slug-like creature and a glob of goop just falls out of its mouth and onto Gilly's head. No! Gross. (laughs) So then, um, I am going to move uh, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25 feet straight up um, in this space here beside Gilly okay. and all that sort of thing. Because I'm still invisible. So yep. while, while I'm invisible, my attacks have advantage and attacks against me have disadvantage. Yes. Uh, fun fact, the... Only spells that I have that are spell attacks instead of asking for saves are my cantrips. So, anyways, uh, what Daniel? He would have had to run through sickening radiance to get there. Okay, I will do that at the end. We'll do that at the end. Okay. Just, I, 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 I feel so bad being in it, mean phaser. No, you gotta have sorry. somebody that remembers it, things. When I enter the 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 when space, you enter it for the first time, or okay, do their or start okay. your turn there. Yeah, okay. I mean, I'm still an ally, right, of Winter, so I would have entered yeah, into yeah. You're good, this. You're good. Okay, and that's a con save. Con save. Uh, it's seventeen. Heard it, so uh, it has to do some con saves. I I rolled a nineteen. You're good, right? Nice. No phases. Uh, yeah, 19, yeah, nineteen. Yeah, you're good. Yeah. You're good. And we yeah. have been hurting it. Okay, so remind me. I am going to. Oh, hang on. How do I want to do this? I like 
because of everything that's going on, do I do I think that the way FaZe is acting is weird? Mm-hmm. Or not? Yeah, you do. You do. Why is she attacking you? Why is she attacking everyone else? You see this creature. No one in their right mind would defend this creature. So... The first thing I want to do is attack the Hydra with a shocking grasp. Okay. It's the first thing I want to do. So I'm going to attack with advantage because I'm invisible. Uh, That's a 28 to hit. Okay, you hit. So that's 12 points of lightning damage. Okay, it takes 12 points of lightning damage. And And then... uh, Wait, what is the what would be the con save for that? Con save. Oh, for twelve damage, it's a DC ten. Okay, you're fine. It's it's fine. Continue. Uh, and then I'm gonna use my meta magic. Okay. And I'm going to quicken spell dispel magic on Phaser. Beautiful. Uh. Yeah, she does. she doesn't have a reaction. Well, she also can't see me. I'm invisible. Yeah. Okay. So, so she can't she can't counterspell my spell. Can't counter spell it, it drops. I think you have to roll. Uh, if it's dominate person, oh, it's, it's a it's fourth. Yeah, it's fifth level. I think fifth. fifth I think. Yeah. Roll. Okay. Let me roll. Let me check it. Yeah, it's fifth. Phase okay. has it too. Okay. What'd you get? Uh, Do you still have your bardic? I have my bardic from Dan still, yeah. So yeah, if does, you wanted does. to add that. You could add that. Because uh, it's, uh, yeah, I rolled a 13, which isn't enough. So it's a d10 from Dan, right? D8. D8 from Dan? Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, okay. So 13 plus uh, my charisma, which is 5. So 18. I rolled an 18, which is more than enough. It drops. Beauty. The false Hydra loses constant or lo- loses control of Faza, and Faza looks up at it with absolute horror. We'll make sh- we'll see if she actually recognizes what she is seeing next round. Um anything else? Uh no, that would be it because I used my I, I quickened my s- dispel magic so that it was a bonus action spell. And then I had uh, done my cantrip with my action. So, I mean, I guess I have five feet of movement left and it can't see me. So I, I'll i move just sort of back a little bit. But that's it. Damascus. Um, for Thesa will drop the spell. Uh, it doesn't take an action or anything to drop a concentration spell. So she'll stop concentrating on that spell. Yeah, we, yeah. Yes, okay. Obviously, she would have dropped the spell as soon as it it lost control of her. Just making sure. Wisdom save. Uh, What do I add? Is it two? It is two, okay. Uh, That is 15 on the dot. I'm getting nervous, okay? (laughs) (laughs) I'm going to roll something Mm -hmm. to see. Fuck! Nat ones. Um, um, I have help that could come at any moment, and it's not coming. It's fine. I'm going to. I do, I'm going to stay where I'm at and just Eldritch blast the thing. Um, actually, before I do that, I'm going to. Uh, help the. Oh no, I don't have any left. Uh, I have one. Three. Uh, luck point that I can only give to myself. So I'm going to do that. And then I'm just going to Eldritch Blast it. Mm. 18. I was hoping for a 19. Uh, they both hit. The lower ones okay. are 22. Nine plus 22 is 31. You do 31 points of damage. It's looking real rough, guys. It's looking real rough. Um, and 
with that, oh fuck, four points. I yeah, take four points. With that, its second head falls off again. Ah. So that it can't start singing again. And yeah, you do take some. You it would it would immediately scream at you and you take five psychic damage. Okay, Damascus is looking real rough. All right. Is they that your turn? Have... Well, uh yeah. Bonus action. Gilly. Or sorry, move into flurry. Right. Let's see if I still see. Oh, fuck me. Really? Yeah. <laughs> really? Even with winters plus five? Is Yes, I rolled a three. It's not with advantage <laughs> anymore, is it? No. no. Ah. God, but this it's all, is it's annoying. It's not a D, minus a d4 either. Okay. Um, so what the hell am I all it? sticky? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> The question. Why is that sticky? Ooh. Important question. Does your octopus see it? Ooh, good call. Good call. Because you know it's going to no. kill it. Oh. No, okay. If you want, you can bloop away from that area. Natural oh, I'm that octopus. <laughs> your poor octopus. No, I can't bloop away any- anymore because that was oh, my you previous can't. rage Shit. effect. Yeah. yeah. Yes, okay. she, she got that retribution thing going on. Mm-hmm. Although, so I need it to attack me. <laughs> mm-hmm. What, what was all though? Roll. Wisdom save. Uh, wisdom save is fine with like a twenty-eight. You're good. Um, winner is still five feet away from it where yeah. he is. Then he is gonna swing up. No, he's not. He's got to move up once. One, but he will. There you go. Oh, okay. I, I thought he was five feet. Okay. Uh, either a seventeen and a fifteen, both to hit. So. Yep, both hit. Uh, the eight plus eight. Let's go. Um, you know what? I I will I will tell you now. It has sixty four hit points. Oh. Sixty four. Yeah. Light. I mean, it's up to you. I, I'm definitely going to smite. It was like, I was going to do two first level smites. Knowing that there's 64 HP, I'm not going to change that. Because like that would kind of be too much meta knowledge. So I um, gave it to you. So if you want to, you can. No, that's okay. So I'm going to roll 68. Okay. So nine. It's four is thirteen plus ten is twenty three. Um, plus eight is thirty one. So thirty one points of damage from winter. Oh, okay, okay. It's so close, and it screams at you. Let's just do yeah. that. Uh, three. Three points of damage. Okay, yeah. he takes it. Is and that his then turn? That's it. He's got no more bonus action attacks. Faiza? Faiza is going to just I think pissed off at being controlled. Oh, I gotta make a save for her. Never mind, let's see if she's pissed off. Not 20. She's pissed off at being controlled. <laughs> uh, just unleashes rage. Jess, I'm going to have to ask you to describe what she sounds like or says as she just blasts a bolt of lightning directly into this thing's face at the the highest level of power she can summon. Just crackling with light, her hair kind of frizzing up through the electrical energy going through her. She's doing it at fifth level. Okay, it's with disadvantage because it's right beside her. And that's range. Oh, it's a saving throw. Yes, fucking good. Okay. She looks at this thing and she goes, I won't ever be controlled again. And just (laughs) bam. And we're going to make it's going to fail with a 13. All right. That is 10d6 lightning damage. And that will be pretty good. 41 lightning damage directly to this thing's batch. I won't ever be controlled again! This place lights up. 
with an immense amount of electricity somehow missing all of you, but all of you feel your hairs on your arms and the back of your necks begin to stand. Your hair begins to float. Her hair is just, the static electricity is insane. And she fries this thing within an inch of its life. The laugh that was about to come out of its mouth dying in its throat and it falls to the floor dead baller you're out of initiative or if you're out of combat uh and do we all know what's going on now session. you all know what's going on now you remember everything why you came here everything thank goodness and we will pick up next session with what happens Oh, no. I'll tell you about all the st- all the shit that you find and all your stuff in our after session. Panda camera. Hell yeah. We remember everything. <laughs> everything. Ev- everybody. Oh shit. <gasps> Ooh. And, and that's the end of the session. <laughs> blah, blah, blah. <laughs> you do not remember the per- the people it has already killed though. Oh, okay. okay. Uh- you do not remember the people it has already killed, but we, you do know why you're there. But that just for dr- dramatic effect, we remember everybody. <laughs> everybody. Everything. Okay, we will see Asterisk. you guys next week. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Do we want to do our sign off? <laughs> sure. Yeah. I am Ice D Stars, and I've been your shenanigan sovereign. Go ahead, Daniel. Dan, uh, the speed of candy on the internet. Damascus Silver. James. Good fucking job. Good fucking job. (laughs) It's fantastic. Everybody's so (laughs) eloquent. It's wonderful. Hi, I'm James. Uh, You can find me as Mazrix or Mazrix24, pretty much any place on the internet. Tonight, I played Varian Arbor, our very confused Storm Soul Sorcerer, uh, who is uh, hiding out in Arav Deus Ark's party, who is uh, our Circle of Stars druid. And uh, Caro. Imaginary Caro on the internet. Real Caro in real life. Uh, playing <laughs> Gilly. The <laughs> water genasi. Uh, what's she? Barbarian. Yes. Wild magic. Who has not Okay. <laughs> we'll see you next week. Bye. <laughs>